All right. Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome to the stream. Uh, as the title suggests, today we are participating in the world's first zero kill loss tournament. Uh, now that obviously requires some significant explanation because it's a bit confusing. Um, so any of you who've seen my last video, um, I partnered with a plat platform called repeat.gg, uh, a Warzone, pla uh, Warzone tournament platform where you can win real money. Um, and I think it was Cornbread in the Jam Cow Discord pointed out that they actually have a pacifist tournament, right? So I'm going to bring this up and I'm going to show you. This is the pay attention because th um, this is the I'm going to try and explain this as as in as much detail as I can, so that anyone who needs to can just scroll back to the beginning of the stream and they'll see this explanation. Okay, so look, let me swap over to this. Okay, so this is the Sunday Fun Day One Day Tournament. Some of their tournaments last, you know, a day, a week, a month. Um, this one, I put a link in the description so you can join the platform, use my link, whatever, if you want. Um, this is a pacifism tournament in battle royale solos. Okay. Um, and it only lasts for the next six, you know, six and a half hours or something. It's, it's a one day tournament. I don't know why it's Sunday fun day, but it starts kind of like midnight this morning and runs until midnight tonight. Um, and crucially, this is how the scoring works. Okay. So typically a typical tournament they'll grant you points for placement as well as points for kills. And this tournament gives you, uh, let's see if I can zoom in, make this a little larger, I don't know. With this, there we go. So points for placement, right? Um, no, no, no points gained or lost for deaths. Uh, no, but crucially negative points for kills. So you're punished for getting kills, right? And you're also punished for damage. So ideally you want zero damage, but this is the, this is a slightly mysterious thing. You get zero points for first place. Now, the only explanation I can think of is that uh, they they didn't want to grant like 120 points for first place and then just only punish you for 20, like minus 20 points for kills because then someone would still just like, they'd wait until the final 1v1 and then they'd, they'd kill the last guy basically, right? And so it wouldn't even like you... A lot of people would think that the best the best strategy is kill the last guy for like for a hundred points. So I mean, the way they they probably could have rebalanced this by just making it like minus a thousand points or something for kills. So even getting one kill would completely chalk your points. Um, but this is the way they balanced it at, at least. So um, the most points you can get if you get zero kills and zero damage, the most points you can get is second or third place, and you'll get one hundred twenty points. So all I'm going to try to do is come second or third with zero kills. Um, and okay, so I'm going to switch over to the game. I've made one change to my loadout. Instead of running knives, I've run Molotovs so that if I get to the top three or top two, um, I can burn myself with a Molotov and just guarantee I leave the game. Um, there's a slight, I suppose there's a slight risk that if it gets down to the final... 1v1 the last guy could disconnect or he could like you know the last two guys could like kill each other potentially like they fight in the gas and the winner the winner like dies um and i might accidentally win but that's a risk i'm willing to take um and it's just top five matches that's all it is top five matches what the hell champions quit i think i think mini br i think mini royale duo is actually counts for Champions Quest, because I was playing mini Royale duos over the weekend. I got a couple wins. This is that, that's a little that's a little surprising. I didn't expect the Champions Quest progress to to run in mini Royale duos. That's weird. Just just thought that. As soon as you get third, you exit the game. I think that would probably work, Marty. That would give me third place. Um, but just to just to make it absolutely clear, I'm going to try to actually die in game and get the third place screen or the second place screen. So I know for certain that that was the placement I got. Dominican, uh, if uh, you haven't yet checked Discord, uh, do take a look. Sent you some messages. Right, so I haven't actually played in. Well, I played played last night actually. I haven't played today. I haven't played zero kills. Let me get get some stuff out of the way. 
I need to clear my desk. How is everybody on this fine Monday morning in America or Monday evening in Asia? Thaddeus says good evening. Won't everyone just be chilling in Final Circle? Uh, well, uh, the, this is a public lobby, so everyone else is trying to kill. Everyone else is trying to kill. So, this is a normal match. I'm the only one being a weirdo. But, um... <laughs> I mean, this is probably the most perverse game of Warzone you're ever going to see. Because it's one... Th I'm already weird, weird enough to try to go for the win with zero kills. But, you know, at least that's kind of what... That's that's kind of the, maybe the core tension of battle royale as a as a drama. So like if you look at you know the original battle royale movie, the Japanese movie, right? Um, like the crux of the drama in a battle royale movie or the Hunger Games is it takes like normal decent people and forces them to kill for survival. It's like it's you or me, right? Um, and like, and there are plenty of superhero stories like this as well, where you have, like, Superman versus, like, you, you have so, someone, someone takes a superhero who doesn't kill and says you need to kill someone in order to save the world or whatever. And they, But their job is to find some secret other way that they can, uh, that they can avoid killing. So I think going for zero kills with the win is not that perverse, actually. It's just, uh, it's a principled refusal to kill and a refusal to die but going for a zero kill loss is utterly abjectly perverse by any standard so this is the most backwards gameplay you're ever going to see you thought everyone in the lobby was pacifist no this is not a custom this is not a custom lobby with a uh what is why is this yellow plane just following me what is happening is this is it, oh it was dropping cash boxes okay I was I was expecting it to drop a loadout yeah this is not a custom lobby this is a public lobby and um, everyone's playing normally except me so everyone's everyone else is trying to kill me. But I actually, actually, um, normally I don't care too much about damage. Like, like I'll throw a stun at someone if I need to escape or something like that. But for this, I'm actually slightly penalized. You get like, you know, 7% of a point off for, uh, for damage. So actually, if you did 100 damage, you'd only lose 7 points. So I think even if I did 1 damage with a stun, it probably wouldn't even register. Because it will be... 7% of a single point lost for one damage using a stun. So it's not very bad. Uh, but still, I'd like the, the best the best possible score you can get is 120 points per match. Oh, I hear footsteps. I think this I guess that was my own footsteps. I don't know, dude. I don't really need stims. I'm going to get smokes from my loadout and just try to fill up on as many smokes as possible. Because I'm not even going to make a gas play at the end. I'm only wearing a gas mask because it might help me rotate when the circle shifts at the end. Like I can pre-rotate to the next zone and that's it. Ooh, there we go. Smoke. That's all I need. Actually, I'm going to drop this. Let's see if I can... See if I can go over here to the ammo cache, get more smokes. Smokes and plates, pretty much all I really need. There we go. Pretty stacked. Oh, uh, UAV just came in. Someone's going to be coming for me, maybe. Um, I guess I can just wait for the free loadout. And then we just... We just Maybe I want to buy a self-revive at maybe this buy station. Then I'll use the drone to go to wherever my loadout comes in. Hello there, unbelievable. Just so I'm clear, your goal is to make it to final two, then lose. Yeah, I'm going to try and... I'm going to try and... Uh, come second place with zero kills. 
That's 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 the the dream. But third place works as well. There's no penalty for third versus second place. Top three is the same. Top, top three is the same number of points. Unless you come first, in which case you get nothing. So this tournament is a little backwards. Could buy a loadout here. Like there's someone here. Oh crap! Because all the doors are open, and everything, bro. Let's just go for the free loadout. I wanted to use the drone, unfortunately. I bet he's got a loadout at the same crate as mine, and he's going to use the drone. Yeah, there he is. He's literally going for it. Okay, well, that means that I can go to the buy. That's fine. Oh! It wasn't him? It was a different guy? This guy's gone flying else. Okay, whatever. Two guys have left the area. I'm probably okay. If I can find the buy station. I'm going to put a shield on my back. Uh, just to keep me alive. And then we'll try to go for the loadout. And we'll just get smokes. And we'll be fine. So, in theory, the best... In order to get first place in this... The, the highest... Oh, there's a dude. The highest score you could possibly get is five matches where you've got 120 points clean. Oh, I'm getting sniped at, dude. That's not good. Oh, that was a... I should, should have bought a loadout. Then I could have got, got that self arrived for free. Wouldn't need to faff around this loadout here. I don't really want a second self revive, really. It's not that important. I'm not really trying to. I'm just trying to make it to the, the final circle. I don't really care if I've lost my self revive on the way there. First place, you get no points. Second or third place, you get 120 points. So, Odium. Uh, I believe the reason this. Oh, I've got a UAV. My only theory for why the tournament is this way is that kills aren't punished very much it's just minus 20 points oh, look, this guy's straight up camping the loadout i'm gonna risk everything on this loadout dude is he He's climbing up to the roof Oh crap! This that's just that's just that's just stupid, super dumb. I just shouldn't, I shouldn't go for that loadout while he's camping it like that, dude. That's a fool's errand. Wonder if he's gonna come. He's got a UAV. He's not. He's gonna find me. We just gotta, we gotta pre barricade, I guess. Just hang around. Wait. He'll move on. Ideally, get a uh, you know a perspective to look over this guy. Oh, there, there he's on the roof. We can watch to see when he leaves. But I guess since we're not really trying to prep for the end game, we don't really need to amass much resources. Yeah, so, so my, my best guess for why they aren't rewarding. This guy's trying to snipe me, dude. This guy really... Can I open the door, dude? M maybe I should just go and make money and buy my own loadout. Really regret not buying it early when I had the chance. Here, a crate. I'll take some perks, why not? Yeah, it's closing in. Relocating the safe zone. My only explanation for, my only theory for why they might be basically punishing first place is you, they don't want you to kill the last guy. Because kills only, only reduce your score by 20 points. A better way to do it would be to just 
increase make it a really severe penalty for killing like minus a million points so then there'd, there'd be no way of compensating for a kill with placement points but that's not how they've done it oh another smoke Enemy soldier incoming. another self revive Okay, note to self, don't bother buying self revives ever again. Because they just... Oh, we've got plenty of time. It's in the middle of the zone. That sniper's not going to move, though. That's the problem. Three hundred. I need twelve hundred more. I feel like I could. Ooh, what the? Oh, he's still up there, dude. The enemy lost track of what if I just do a sneaky? Nah, never mind. I've got money for a loadout. I'm just gonna go to the buy and get my own. Let them fight like Godzilla and Kong. Whoa, whoa! No thanks. So many UAVs have been popped on me. In the last few minutes. It must be because it's center zone. A lot of people coming into the center of zone and just trying to find a building to hold down. Alright, there's not much, not much else for me to... To do here. Can I get my loadout? Stop moving. Let me get my loadout. Alright, cool. All good. Is there a better place to hide? Maybe, but, you know, being near the drone's not bad. I might try to get even closer to the drone if I can. Just get in this building. Feel little strongholdy building. The way this tournament works is you just play as many games as you want and your best five games count. So if I can get five second place zero kill zero damage, then that's the maximum score you can possibly get and no one can beat me. Does Riot Shield always eat so much performance? Yes, as well as posting on Twitter about, look, it tanks your FPS. Okay, so one thing I wanted to check, that's, uh, I suspect it, it could be the screen space, space reflections, which also reduce, which also cause you to have loads of glare. Wait. Nah, doesn't help. But I wonder if this would stop. So if, if when I have the light behind me, see you have this like light, you have this like glare on your lens that on your like the glass that covers what you're seeing from the light bulb behind me. It's like uh, I was hoping that might get switched off and that might be causing the uh, the low FPS, but it's not. Uh, where's a good spot to hide in this building, dude? That might be up up top. Might be the best place. I don't know. Up in this uh, dropping into the area. Watch the skies. In this sofa. I don't know. You got gas moving in. Just make second and first worth the same amount of points. Then killing first place makes no sense. Yeah, I mean, there's that as well. I think the best way would be to give more points for first place, but also, you know, punish kills with a lot more points. Yo, Jam Cow, your awesome one guy had to come hit the like. Hopefully, everyone in chat doing great. Let's see, how many likes do we have? We've already got... Thank, thank you to 37 people who've already already come and liked the stream of, of the worst Warzone gameplay in streamer history. Zero kill loss. I'm aiming for a zero kill loss. This is definitely the worst Warzone gameplay in history. 
could be a nerf making you lag more than using your shield. Um, from what I understand, transparency is simply a, is is simply just a. It's intrinsically difficult to render graph from a like a computer graphics standpoint. Um, it's that's not to say that they maybe couldn't simplify it and make it do, make it um. Uh, I guess like less heavy because clearly clearly what's going on right is like let's say I have the let's say they have the reflections right there's this reflection I know exactly where the light source is right and what what they have as part of the glass texture is some kind of dynamic reflection based on the environment so it's rendering some version of my environment at least the light sources a second time and maybe that's kind of intense I don't know so I I'm, I posted a tweet sort of asking Raven Software um, slash Beanox slash S, uh, Sledgehammer Games to, to look at it and look into maybe fixing it if that was a possibility. I don't need this extra self revive, dude. I'm gonna drop that there as a honey pot. Make a make whoever comes up the stairs look at that instead. All right, kind of a rough kind of a rough circle, but I guess I don't have to move yet, so it's it's fine. This drone will stay here, I hope. Or just stay here. If you don't have to move, don't move. Did you disable ray tracing? Yeah, I don't have ray tracing on. I, tr I turned it on once to see what it looked like. And I guess the game kind of looked nicer. Ooh. Someone, someone might have landed on me with a UAV. Or he might have just gone for the drone. Don't mind me, bro. Okay. Bit of a faff. Bit of a faff. But that got my heart bumping, heart pumping a little bit. I've got an armor box I could pop to get more plates, but I don't need to just yet, so I might not. I think I, I think the guy who just pushed me was just on the roof sniping, and he just got down by someone over end. here with a full auto AR. But he's still up top. He's still up top. He just got downed. I could hear him like collapse and hit the hit the floor just gonna try and farm up some extra smokes do I have room to carry I don't really have room to carry six extra plates just five so I might just hold onto the plate box for now put your predictions for the next zone I don't know I'm thinking straight down the middle it's gonna be awful my guess. Gas yep. Is inbound, a nowhere. Signal. Nowhere is safe. Like, where do you go here, dude? Maybe here? I don't know. Where's a good crevice to hide in? I don't know this part of the map very well. Um, now, do we take the drone or the LTV? I feel like the... I feel like the LTV might be for the best. Can I move, please? I couldn't... I feel like my slide is, like, way less responsive now for some reason. I don't know. Like, I'm lagging out. I guess maybe I could just camp in the... Oh, there's a guy r running near the, the loadouts. I could just camp in the LTV, and they, people would know where I am. But... But they hopefully wouldn't push me as long as I just keep moving. And I can survey the whole the whole circle. And, ooh, I could go up this uh, billboard. That would have been good. If I'd used the drone, I would have just landed on that billboard. That's a perfect spot. But maybe we can just keep, keep orbiting, wait for the next zone. Already a top eight. I just need five more people to die and then it doesn't matter. I've got max points. All right, ladies and gentlemen, if you are just tuning in... We are in a pacifist tournament where wins get zero wins get zero points. 
the second and third place gets 120 points. So all I need to do is last until second and or third place. And don't do any... And I'm punished for kills and damage. I currently have zero kills and zero damage. So if I can come second or... Oh, there's a guy ahead. If I can come second or third place, we get maximum points. I think there's no one over here. Unless, unless there, there might be a guy like... I don't think there's a guy here, so I'm going to stay on this side of the circle. And point my... Point the rear end of my car into the zone. Maybe if I go, actually go under the bridge, I'll be protected from even more angles. Yeah, I think this is... Yeah, no, this is this is okay. Still five people alive. I want two more to die, and then I can come third place no problem. I might I might try to outlast until second place just just to push myself. But once I hit third place, it, there's no more risk. Everything's fine. There, there's a dude over there, little ranked. Oh crap! He's trying to snipe me. Oh crap, don't mind me. Don't want to run you down. Okay, so we've got sniper up there. I don't know if there's a safe place for me to really go. Maybe I could drive behind this wall. Play up in the gas. Uh, let's switch, switch seats, play up in the gas. It didn't really, it didn't really help me. Just kind of cost me a gas mask for no reason. It's third. It's third place now. Hello, everyone. Can you hear me? Don't worry. That. Hey, bro. Do you want to get get on the back of my car? Get on the back. Get on the back of the car. Get on the back. Now let's go kill him. Let's go kill him. No. Okay. Hey. Hey. Rank skin. Get on the back. Get on the back. All right. GGS. GGS, bro. GGS. Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we came. We came second place. <laughs> That's second place. Zero kills, zero damage. That's 120 points right there. That is the maximum score you can get in this tournament. <laughs> and you don't have to go in the gas. You don't have to make a gas play for this. You know, you're not trying to get wins. All right. Maybe we should add some text or something. I don't know. Like. Uh... I don't know. I'll just pull out. Actually, maybe I should... Um, do I want to see the names of anyone in this lobby? I'm going to see if I can add... See if I can add some text on screen here. Uh, the intermission screen has some text, I think. Copy. Paste a duplicate. So I'm going to change this. How do I... Uh, okay, we're, we're going to pull out. We're going to leave match. We're going to get into another match. Why second place? Okay. Um, I'll do another explanation. Give me a moment. Um, I just need to make this little pop-up. I should have done this earlier. My apologies. Okay, let, let's, get, let's, let's start loading in another match. There we go. How do I change the text? There we go. Uh, one of five, zero kill losses. Or z zero kill losses, one out of five. There we go. Okay. Um, transform center horizontally. So you guys can see this, right? It's showing up. This text right here. So the, I'm going to switch, I'll switch over to the, I'll show the scoring. Uh, for anyone who's just joined and wants an explanation uh, for the how the scoring works here. So we are playing the repeat.gg Sunday Funday pacifism tournament battle royale solos uh i don't know does it is it going to show me 
it, there's like six hours left on this tournament. It's just it just runs today. It's a one day tournament. But critically, uh, so the way they're making this a pacifism tournament is you lose 20 points for every kill. Instead of gaining 20 points for a kill, you lose 20 points per kill and you lose you lose points for damage even, right? Um, but unusually, you go you don't get any placement points for first place. You get placement for second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, and eighth. The best placement points is 120 placement points for second and third place. Um, and so it's like why why are you not why are you not rewarding people for um mute this um why are you not rewarding people for getting first place and i think the only explanation i have is that if first place was like 120 points or 140 points or something like that but the a kill only was minus 20 then a lot of people would kill the last guy for the placement points to get like first place so they don't want to incentivize you to kill even the last guy so that's the way it's yeah, that's the way it's worked out for what for better or worse. Um, there we go. The, the the last guy actually got on the back. I, I, like, I wasn't expecting it, but once it got to the top three, I can just completely mess around. I'm not even trying to survive. I can completely mess around with with uh, the with the last three people with the last two guys i can absolutely i can absolutely mess with people because i'm not i do not want to win i do not want to win um all right <laughs> In once more into the fray wait why is my whole game my whole Oh, there we are. My whole PC was muted. All right, there we go. Um, let's go back to, you know, the Levine Resort. Actually, it's kind of under the flight path. It might be a little busy. Let me go down here to the bank. Little banky-wanky. Little banky-panky. This tourney is made for jam. I can't imagine that it is because I think anyone who's... Anyone who, if you were making a tournament for me, it would be all about the win, right? You, you would, you would have, you would make, you know, you would make, first place would be like 100 points. Any other placement would be like zero. And kills would be like, oh, there's a dude, right, landing on the burger shot, okay. i got to remember, I can't even do damage to like scare people off. That's unfortunate. Like, I can't even throw a stun. When I'm on Vondel or whatever, like, I always pick up whatever tactical I can. Whoa, my mouse is spazzing out. I would throw stuns and whatever, right? And I'd be able to escape people. Oh, I hear footsteps. There's someone in the bank already. I'm leaving. Someone came in the front door, probably. I'm not going to go to the burger shop because I saw a guy there. Uh, this is not great. One thing um, I'm not sure about is anyone who saw my last video. Oh, Dominican, thank you for the $5. Hit the like or you will get first place. No, don't jinx it. I don't want first place. Uh, one thing I am actually not sure about is I think that what shows in game as your damage might not be entirely related to what the API returns as your damage. So when the tournament tracking website gets my damage, um, I think it, I, so, so for example, if you saw my video, you saw me do use the shock sticks and they did zero damage or the scoreboard in game showed zero damage, right? Even when I spammed a guy with multiple shock sticks, which seemed like really weird because I was getting like hit markers. It's like, why isn't this doing damage? Like, surely it's, surely it's doing damage. Um, I, th I think that on the back end, on the server end or something, the the damage being calculated by. Um, should I? I'm gonna keep up, keep saving up for a, a, a full loadout rather than spending it on a riot shield. I thought there was a way up even higher here. I guess not. I, I think that on the back end. 
more damage is counted. So, for example, I just saw some shock sticks, and for a second I thought, ooh, I could use shock sticks to escape, because those do zero damage. Oh, crap, someone's trying to shotgun me from miles away. Wait, why can't I see this guy? Oh, he's, he's left, okay. Is he still chasing? He's still left. He hasn't pushed over here, it seems. I was thinking maybe I could use shock sticks because they do zero damage. Gas is going to pull this guy into my backside. But I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit concerned that maybe the tournament secretly counts more damage than you might think. Like, I think... Um, I think one tournament I accidentally... I shot a guy who then died, died to gas. And I got way more damage for that than I... It, like extra, it counted extra damage. I think that it's doing some kind of weird damage attribution where you get gas damage if you if you hurt someone who then dies to gas, even if you don't get kill credit. But that's not shown in game. And because the tournament calculates the damage however it does, I am wary of doing anything that might get overestimated by the tournament. Ooh, Jude. Thank you for the dono. I am just going to quickly grab my loadout. And keep moving. Get somewhere safe so I can read it. Uh, I'm pretty... Pretty stacked on plates. Uh, and money, to be honest. Uh, okay, Jude. Jude Camberos. Says, as a, as a hardcore leftist, jam, ca jam makes COD exciting again. I don't know what... Is, there, is, that, a, is, that, a politi is there a political valence there? Is it is it left-wing friendly? Or is it... I didn't think it was... Uh, I didn't think it was a political stance, but... Um, I'm glad you're enjoying the content anyway. Ooh, self-arrive? Nope. Thank, th thank you very much, Jude. I suppose the, the bleeding heart liberal stereotype is like, you know, non-violence. So I, c I can kind of see the connection you're making there, dude. Ooh, another smoke. Perfect. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That, if, you, if you agree with Jude, if you like what Jude said, do like Jude's um, message. There's this new functionality on YouTube where you can like someone else's super chat. Let me see if I can go to this buy station out, climbing up the ladder and open like a bot. Get myself a selfie. I don't really need anything else, to be honest. Maybe an armor box? Maybe a loadout? Where's the, where's the buy station here? Okay. All right, let's get self-res. What do we have? What else do we have? We could buy UAV. I think I'm going to buy... I'm going to buy this. Literally just to get some more smokes, and then we're going to do this. And then, then we're going to go in. Ooh, is there a cash register? That's already been taken. I'm not, in, I'm not in a great spot here. I'm running out in the open with the gas on my back. I want to hit a drone and just hard rotate all the way into the zone. Maybe up here at this this drone up here, maybe? But pushing up this hill is not great. I thought that explosion was someone shooting down the drone for a second. All right, where do we go? Somewhere as as, as f either to the north low town or east Hadika Farms. Not sure which side of the river you'd rather be on here. Uh, when I get closer, I'll take a look. This is kind of uphill. Maybe this building kind of has that building kind of got some higher ground, so I could I could fly across the river if I needed to from this roof, right? If I need to cross this river, it'll be easier going. It would be easy going from here, right? I could fly across here, so I might just stay here. Ooh, this is not... It's a real fake door. 
Okay, this roof is actually... Oh, another smoke. That's, that's kind of nice to have. Okay, I'm gonna open every door so that if I have to move, I can, I'll we'll do so quietly. And we got a fridge. Perfect. Okay, perfect. Um, and I can go up to the roof and fly across the the river if I need to. That's perfect. Ah. Gas is gonna pull this guy into my backside. Well, yeah, you never know. You never know what will pull pull people in. Yeah, Kevin, I think um, I think Call of Duty gameplay crosses political boundaries. We're just gamers, bro. We're not. Uh, I'm not a political analyst. I'm not a pundit. Leave it to a leftist to bring up politics in a video game stream. Okay, people, let's stop. Let's. Uh, Let's 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 prevent the flame war before it happens. We're we're pacifists here. We're not we we don't want to start a war. We don't want to start fighting. Let let let's have a let's have a zero damage conversation. We we just passed a hundred likes. <laughs> a hundred and seven likes. A hundred and seven likes on a stream about z losing the game with zero kills. So thank you to everyone who's already liked the stream. I appreciate it. I think this is uh this this whole stream is an abject perversion. <laughs> if you happen to be one of the last two, you can always use thermite on yourself to ensure you get. That's that's why I look down here. I have a I have a Molotov, just because I, I find I think Molotovs. I feel like Molotovs burn burn you faster maybe than thermites. It or it's just easier to use like. The thermite has maybe a narrower area of effect. Oh, I hear footsteps. Someone's nearby. I, I can't die yet. What the crap? What the hell, dude? Did he? He, have a, he had a heartbeat sensor. Okay, okay, okay. Fair enough. That's why he was walking around so slowly. Fair enough. Fair enough. Jude, thank you for the 999 again. Made that message clear. The comment was so left that Jam is right. That is that makes it even less clear, Jude. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. Okay, so what we need to do in this gulag, we can't use I can't use a flashbang or, or anything. If there's smoke, I could use a smoke. And I'm gonna try and hit the zip. I've even won zero kill gulags by shooting the other guy sometimes, like like I'll, I, I'll shoot if I can get first shots, break his armor. Then he, then he'll like back off, and then I just, and then instead of pushing him like he expects, I just take the zip. Okay, there's a the smoke. I wish there weren't lasers, dude. Alright, we made it. Still zero kill, zero damage. We made out of the gulag. Where did I die though? That's the there's my corpse. Might be worth going back there. There won't be much room to take off my body. I think that's what we do. We full send the corpse. Um I I guess there's if this I don't think this guy, if he was still there, he wouldn't be showing many signs of it. Oh, there's a UAV up. Okay, whatever. Whatever, we'll just YOLO it. Listen for my body. L listen for footsteps. I don't hear anyone, but if this guy was still here, he moved... He moved around pretty cautiously, so I probably wouldn't hear him. Whatever. There's, I have footsteps on the grass. I got my perks. I didn't get my knife, though. That's awkward. Can I get on there? No, I guess not. Uh, I'm, I want to try and check my... Check my body a second time to pick up the knife. The karambit. Just because it makes it easier to run while plating. We'll, 
uh, start farming some stims here. Uh, not stims, smokes. Force of habit. Smokes OP and gulag. Not since they put the lasers on the gun, because the lasers punch straight through the smoke, and so they can still see where your laser's coming from. So the smoke, the lasers on the smoke really, re really are a significant. The lasers on the guns are really a significant nerf to smokes and zip lining out of there. Unfortunately. All right. Cool. All right, we're, we're pretty well set up, actually. I am I should have caught the train. That would have been nice. That would have been a nice, leisurely way to get in the zone. I don't have a self-res or the money to afford one, and there's a guy in these houses who's looking for me. And I've completely abandoned the rooftop that I was going to use as my... from. Oh, there we go. This river is going to push me down downstream, so I need, to, I need to swim to the right because the river's pushing me to the left. See how I'm drifting to the left? I want to... Ooh, no thanks. Don't mind me, bro. I've got... I'm one bullet away from just game over because I don't have a self and this guy's sniping me with an obvious cat AMR vapor trail on his bullet. Might as well throw my uh, plate box, I guess. Loot a little bit. Hit the cash register. Get myself a self res. Ooh, footstep. That wasn't me. Someone's here. Wait. As soon as I stopped moving, the footsteps stopped. Was that? Were those just my footsteps? Ooh, free self res. Don't even need to use the buy station. Oh, there are footsteps here that aren't me. All right. Oh, they're fighting. Perfect distraction. Time to leave. Have fun, guys. Maybe we take the, the buggy. I don't know. I feel like the buggy is not as defensible as the LTV. I can't just troll around in it. Very liable just to get sniped out of this thing. Uh, let's go uphill, right? Uphill to the houses instead of downhill to the gas station, maybe? I don't know. I guess being slightly uphill is slightly helpful. I will try to position my car in such a way that I can drive into the zone if I have to. Like if I have to get inside and really rush away. I think I've been in this house before. I got like I was I was on this fridge and someone just came straight in, immediately saw me and threw a semtex. I blame this little lantern here. Maybe that just made me too bright. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get in this dank corner instead. I can't stand. I don't want to stand. I want to crouch. That'll be fine. That's fine. This, this is probably fine. I'm going to start farming up some extra smokes. Just just have loads of them. Like I don't need anything else but smokes, really. Jude, thank you for another 9.99. As an American jam is what happens when the school shooter is the valid valedictorian. <laughs> Or did you mean to did you mean to type Valor Victorian? Because I just go for wins. Salut mon frère, salut money. Only ten left. Bonjour. Bonsoir. I think the scoring says you get 120 whether you're second or third. Yes, yeah, yeah. It, the scoring is the same for second place or third place, Crow Cutter. Zero points for first place, 120 for th second or third. Okay, we need to get in the corner of this house. I need to get upstairs because there's no indoors inside. Get in the toilet. There we go, perfect. Right, I'm just in. I was hoping that, you know... The, uh, whoever was fighting here would be kind of distracted. And I think they were. Just got to be wary of heartbeat sensors. And, and UAVs as well. Because someone might come... If they don't have a UAV ping on me, 
I don't think anyone's finding me in this dank bathroom. This is like straight out, straight out of saw. This is a saw bathroom right here. Why I say zero plus 120? I think they're talking about like, you know, whatever your score is. Or like there, there are different ways you can say like some, some, some tournaments will give more placement points is like number of kit you get you get like you don't just get points for the placement you get points per kill for the placement so you want to get high kills and high placement or something like that so that's that's the format they're framing it as all right this might be right okay all i is it's top four i only need one to die and we're fine as long as if if, if i can outlast one person you know, maybe what we do, actually, is we we wait for that. We'll go up to the roof and use the buy station. We can buy a couple gas masks. And once it goes down to three, we'll go in the circle and we'll start trolling around, waiting for someone to kill us. Yes, Epic, I'm in a tournament where you get zero points for first place, but you get 120 points for second or third. How do I get up to the roof here? That's the question. Someone's, someone's trying to nade me up here, dude. I'm going to th throw a distraction smoke. Make them think I've wrapped over to that side instead. How is it still four people, dude? Okay, top three situation already. That's nice. Hello, guys. How we doing? Up, up, and away. No. Your tracking needs improvement, dude. Your tracking needs some severe improvement. Hey, dude. Can you hear me? Hello? 1v1, can you hear me? If you can name the actor who plays Iron Man, aka Tony Stark, I will I will let you win. Hello. Can you hear me on Prox Chat? We're hey, there we go. Good job, Twitch. Twitch Tony. We both win on this blessed day. Twitch I guess he's got doesn't have Prox Chat turned on. Oh well. I was trying to do a game show, bro. Steezy Sea Monkey, thank you for the five dollars. Just started playing for Stim wins. Overall, been working out, but struggling with Stim timing. Any suggestions to time Stim's better audio visual cue? Okay, right. I, I will. I will. I will. Uh, yeah, I. I. I have a. I, I have a tip for you. Let me just leave, I guess. Uh, and we will. Which I'm just gonna update this. We'll get we'll get into another match. That's back to back as well. Back to back maximum points. Lovely. Um, we'll go to solos. Okay. So Steezy Sea Monkey. Um, the key to really good stim timing is remembering that. So the the actual stim animation seem it seems as far as I can tell, seems like it takes exactly one second from when you press the button. Um. And so what you want to do is actually press the button right after the gas hits you. And then, so one second later, the gas will hit you again, and then the animation will complete and you'll start healing right after the next gas tick, right? And a visual clue for that is you'll notice when the gas hits you, it takes like a red chunk out of your health, right? So your, your health will be sitting there, wherever it is. And then a red chunk like appears. Let me see if I can find a clip, like just, just to... Just to, you know, demonstrate. Um, uh, here's, here's an example. Here's an example over here, right? So you see like down, down here, here's my health, right? When the gas hits me, a little red chunk appears. So you can use that. You, you, all you need to do is watch. As soon as that red chunk appears, that's when you press the button. Like you just you just want to press it right when that happens. Like reaction time 
as fast as possible immediately after that, like one millisecond after that. And once you get really good at it, it's possible to be too good at this to the point where you anticipate it. And sometimes you'll press your stim button one frame too early, which means that your stim healing will start exact like one frame before the gas hits you on the next next tick and you get absolutely no health so the, the it's a weird situation where absolutely perfect stim timing is one frame away from the worst possible stim timing so don't worry about getting it too exactly because it is actually possible to get to be too exact and maybe overshoot and and uh get nothing back uh rule of thumb is the bigger this red chunk is like you see how I'm going to show you how the red chunk first appears and then it shrinks. It's like chunk, shrink, chunk, shrink. And the, the bigger the chunk is when you actually press the button, the more health you're going to get. So like, I'm just going to mute this background. Um, if you can, if you can, if you can press your stim right at the maximum chunk here, then you will get full health. If you press your button once it's shrunk to like half its width, then you'll get about half your health back. This is resurgence stims because resurgence stims will give you full health, right? BR is like divide this all by three. It's, it's BR stims are really weak, right? If you press your stim button now, you will get full health. If you press it now, you'll get half health. That, 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 that's the rule of thumb. That's how I get my stims like on point. Um, I suppose there might be some variability with like, uh, input lag so like if you it, maybe if you're on controller or console or, and you maybe playing on a tv as well instead of a monitor like depending on how how severe your whole system latency is uh you might need to slightly modify it i guess um, but that's what works for me i think I, i've got everything i've got my latency crushed way down like i've got very low latency monitor monitor low latency mouse I have my stim button on my mouse. Um, so I'm thinking I don't have much latency to worry about. Uh, that's that, that's that's my tutorial. That's that's my only tip. Um, it is something that once once you figure out a little routine, ooh, durable, lovely. Once you figure out a little routine, um, feeling it is probably the best thing. Like. Just practice it a couple times and you'll get a feel for it and then you'll be able to do it reliably like most of the time. It does kind of require you to look at your health bar though. So sometimes if I'm running away, like if, if I'm running away and trying to navigate, like I'm trying to look at the world right now, I'm not looking at my health bar. I can't, I can't time, I don't time my step. Oh crap, there's a guy ahead of me. Oh, there's, there's a dude in the apartments to my right as well. I got fat stacks of cash. I should just leave. Is this guy chasing me? Or is he just looting building to building? I guess we just we could just swim wide around and go down here, get a lowdown, we'll be fine. You push it before it hits the first plate slot. I mean that that's that's a that's certainly a way to make it like safer. Because that will that will also give you like um That'll also give you kind of a grace period where even if you if you mistimed even if you got no health back from that stim like it was completely opposite stim timing you'll still have a couple ticks left where you could you could hit it again before you go down why is jam losing on purpose um for, for a full explanation you want to scroll way back to the start of the stream just the very beginning of the stream vod will i explain it in detail but long story short, we're in a pacifist tournament for money um, where kills are punished. Neg you get negative points for kills, negative points for damage, and you get placement points only. The only way to get points is placement, but first place has zero points. The best position is to come second or third equivalently. They give you bo both give you 120 points. If you come second with zero kills, zero damage, you get maximum points. You get 120 points, and that's the most you can get. So that's what I'm going for. And it's the best five matches count. So you only need to do this five times. I've done it two times. I've got two perfect scores. Friendly loadout drops on the way. Oh, 
Oh, crap. Was that guy trying to... That guy hit me with an XRK Stalker outside the one-shot range, maybe? He took, a, he took a lot of my health, and I wasn't moving. I don't know, dude. Dark butter is slippery. That's, who, who, who would say that? Someone, there's someone who used to say that all the time. Not guest. Have you changed your name? I'm trying to remember. Um, I can't... Have you changed your name? Guest with the five dollars? Duck butter is slippery? I've, I'm blanking on your name, dude. Do you play off stream to rank up faster? Not really. I, I get, you know, I'm level 324 because I just, I just play a lot. Wins get you a decent number, of, a decent amount of XP. Um, I don't, actually, I don't want to, I don't want an inflatable decoy because I've heard that. It's possible for an infl inflatable decoy to like pop up underneath someone and hit them and do some damage. So I, I'm not, and even kill them. So I don't want to do that. Ah, uh, where's a good spot to hide? Pop off power is actually not looking too, too shabby right now. I could get up one of these cranes maybe. Um, or the cargo. I don't know. Whoop. Do it underneath me. Oh crap, I've been I've been thermited. Oh, I have a redeploy actually. That's not bad. I didn't really have much to live for at that point, honestly. I can now I d I didn't even need I've Got a loadout to land on as well. Can I move, please? Thank you. And I spawned in with an extra smoke as well. That's, that's lovely. Um, that redeploy pack coming in clutch. Ooh, a UAV. Should I save this for the late game? Okay, I'll just, I'll pop this to clear off the area. There's a black site key here. I don't really want to be near that in case someone's coming for it. So I need self-revive plates. I don't really need anything but plates, to be honest. Like, I'm not, not really trying to live that long. But it would be nice to have a self-res. In case I get in a sticky situation. Why is that not picking up? But the... Uh, there we go. Um, okay. Um, I guess we want to pick a buy station. I want to do a big rotation right into the middle of the zone. But I also want to hit a buy station. We could go there. But then where do we go from there? I want to use this drone once. I want to make the most of it. I'll wait for the next zone. And then I'll go to whichever buy station is nearest the middle of the next zone. That's what we'll do. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Rank three twenty four isn't that much. I mean, I, I guess. Does it? Does it? Does it? Does it reward you with anything? I don't. I don't really pay attention to rank. Um, I feel like I should capitalize this text here. Zero kill losses. 
like that. I feel like that looks more official. How many hours do you get to do your five best games? Um, it was about six and a half hours from the start of the stream. So right now it's been about an hour. So we've got about five and a half hours left. And we've already got two of our two perfect games. Um. Oh crap! Why did I stand out in the open? Pull my, pull my map out like a bot, bro. Okay, we've got to go green ping. I'm gonna pop my UAV for this this rotation. Just so I can scope out the area before I move go into it. This person's trying to hit the shot of a lifetime on me in the air. Let me see if I can. Oh, this drone's leaving. There's another snipey boy behind me as well, dude. Okay, crap. Someone in the fire station. There's someone over by the buy. Yep. Someone up the tower. So as long as, as long as I don't give line of sight to the tower, I should be fine. He guy in the tower just shot at the guy at the buy. I don't know if the guy at the buy is still alive because my UAV is not up anymore. So I have no idea if that's safe. But I smashed glass, so tower guy probably knows I'm here. I'm just gonna keep rotating and using the using the drone. I was trying to jump to get up there, dude. We gotta keep going. To this little gas station buy station. Uh, uh self revive. Maybe a muni or something. That's kind of it. Lovely. Um, we could just stay here. Uh, it might be more productive to stay near this drone so that I can rotate. I might move now while I'm safe before the circle gets a little bit dense, more densely populated. Um, either of these two buildings are pretty much equivalently central, like one's not better than the other, but the other one has a drone. Someone's got a UAV on me. Hopefully, they don't have a line of sight on me as well. well we could we could just go up here, man. Like no one's gonna just you know be be hanging out up here for no reason. Problem is, there's someone could be up this field, or even in this tower, and they could snipe me. But so if I just go all the way over here. So if I crouch, I'm pretty sure that my shield will protect line of sight to my head from the tower behind me. So even if someone goes up that tower and I don't know, they can't snipe me in one shot. And I'll just have to be stationary and hope I don't get spotted by uh, anyone on this field in front of me. And we can just hang out and use the drone when we next need to go somewhere. The losses on screen indicate the goal of second or third place. Yes. That's the goal. I think we came second both times as well. Actually, we made it, we made we managed to make it to second place both times. Maybe going tower is safer. It's also higher traffic, poorly. That's sort of why I want to avoid it. Because people love going up like sniper towers. And if I'm in there, I and someone's gonna try to come there and maybe push basically push me out of it. Even if they don't know I'm there, they'll just They'll think that, ooh, free sniper tower. There's no one in there. And then they find me Enemy's and suddenly they shoot me. The ooh, someone's dropping in. Who's dropping in, dude? I saw some, like, sparkles in that doorway. I don't know what that... Oh, there's just, just, just a bunch of sparks going on around that building. It's just part of the building. Oh, he... I guess the guy dropping in landed over at the gas station, buy station I was just at. Bought himself a loadout. He might have just come back from Gulag, actually. He's a redeploy. He's buying himself a loadout. If he redeployed, if he redeployed with enough money for a loadout, that means he died with a lot of money. And this, this dude, I just, either is just really rich or maybe he's been killing a bunch of people. Okay. 
one of those guys was at least decent enough to throw a couple smokes for, for crossing the road. Ooh, another guy's dropping in. I'm just going to stay here. I'm going to stay here. I'm pretty central. No need to move. Uh, and we have a drone for whenever we need to. I can literally hit the drone without touching the ground. So it's fine. It's fine. The difference with this tourney is you at least have a chance to tie jam. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I'm not, I wouldn't be surprised. It just takes five games, perfect score. And you would have the best, the, you'd have the, a perfect score, right? There's, there's actually a hard cap on how many points you can get. If you get five, zero kills, zero damage wins in either second or third place, not wins, zero kills, zero damage games in second or third place, that's the maximum score you could possibly have. And they only count five games, so you only need to get the perfect score five times. Nuke or what? Uh, whoop. I want to, I wanted to, I wanted to alt tab out so I could, s wait, I did alt tab out. What the heck? Okay, whatever. Got 162 likes. Thank you to the 160 lunatics, madmen who've, uh, Mad men and mad ladies who've liked the stream despite there being a zero kill and zero win stream. The in-game chat was indicating a possible hacker. Really? I feel like that's happened every match, though. Bro, are you sure that you can fly? You have your cheat active. Wait. Wait. Is wait, I don't want to be all caps. Is someone hacking? Is inbound, marking a new safe zone. Enemy UAV I just want third or second place, guys. Oh, I'm within the there's a UAV tower right, right towards the drone that I want to take, bro. Okay, I'm gonna hit the um, I'm gonna hit the drone. Crap. This is terrible, dude. I can't, I can't even find the... I'm smoking myself out, bro. I'm a bot. I'm a bot. I'm such a bot, dude. Thanks for the speed boost from Resolute. That was just <laughs> abjectly misplayed by me. It wasn't, it wasn't even that far. There was no reason that I really needed to push the drone. I could have gone there on foot. I'm literally going on there foot. Going there on foot right now. A plate box wouldn't be a miss right now. There's a gas mask I'll take. Thank you. Gratefully accepted. But I do want to get to the uh, big-ish central green building. I don't want to go under there because that will just get stuck there. There's got to be some kind of little boxy crevice I can hang out in. Actually, it's kind of open. Kind of an open plan construction site. I might, I might do this in case I get stuck by a thermite. I can throw the, th I can actually throw a trophy and it will delete the thermite off my body. It'll actually save my life. Ooh, okay, okay. Take your plates. Take the smokes. All right, lovely. I hear footsteps. Or was that my own footsteps? I don't know. Bro, everything's so bright and... Bright and airy. I guess I'll just sit in this dank corner here. Could be worse. The cash... Yeah, the, the, the prize pool is $100. First prize gets $20. So we're trying to get... We're trying to come first place. Because why not? It, like, I feel like... Everyone who gets a perfect score, like it's not hard to get a perfect score, and you can just get first place. He's like a fox in a chicken coop. Ten remain. You're almost I think a fox in a chicken coop would do a lot more damage than me. I'm on zero damage right now. If Jam wins, he can move to Russia and retire on off twenty bucks. Yeah. Ooh, who's droning? Okay, I've got. I might need to dodge these mortars depending on where they're coming from. Oh, what the heck? I 
I guess someone just mort just just decided to double airstrike the central building in case there was someone here. But there was a UAV. There is a UAV up. Someone knows I'm here. That that kind of sucks. Okay. I'm going to stay in this corner till the circle, till the gas is actually on my back, and I'll creep in with the gas to that corner. Once the gas is cleared off the rest of the, the building for me. Two footsteps in the building. Two people down below, I think. They hopefully fight each other before they find me. Guy's coming upstairs, going to come this way, maybe? Yep. Yep. Is he going to spot me, though? That's the question. Oh, crap! Oh, my God. I they, they both they both came around the corner at the same time. It's so awkward. Fair enough. Okay, that, 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 that's, that's not what we want. Sixth place. Well, I guess we still get some... How many... Do we get any points for sixth place? We get 60 points for that, I guess. That's, that's like... That's, that's, that's better than nothing. So we actually did get some points for that. Um, but not a perfect score. So we're, we're, I'm going to go for five games with a perfect score. Because it's, 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 it should be entirely possible to do that. Oh, well. You got distracted. I pr that, to be honest, that probably wasn't the best hiding spot as well. I should have picked a spot with, with only one one point of entry that I could point my shield at and I wouldn't have wouldn't have got shot in the side. Do you think there's any value in buying a second perk package like you had to do when the game was broken? Um I mean it's a uh, it would take a whole backpack slot which is kind of kind of a big investment. I mean, I guess, I guess what you you could swap out. You could have a backpack. You could have a a package with restock only for when you wanted to restock stuff. So if you were just sitting, if you were sitting in a in a corner fully stocked with everything you want, then you could switch to a cold blooded perk package, and then you would never high alert anyone. That's kind of nice, and you'd be able to have both perks. But a whole backpack slot is a lot. It is a lot to give up. Did you ever check the damage? Uh, yeah, I checked my... I opened my... Um, I opened my scoreboard. It showed zero damage. I was curious if you damaged that guy running past him when you were on fire. Um, well, that would count as his, his damage as well. So, like, if, if, if I had a team, right? If, if, if this was squads, if I had a teammate and he threw a thermite... Let's say you stick one, one enemy with a thermite... And their teammate is standing right next to them and gets damage from the thermite as well. Um, the owner of the thermite, the guy who threw it, would get credit for all the damage and all the kills. So if you down two people because they were like stuck, they were hiding, they were stuck in a room or something, right? You would get um, you would get both kill credit. You you get credit for all the damage and all the kills basically. So. That would count if he down like if the if he was really low health and he got downed by me running past him while stuck with a thermite, but it was his thermite. It would count as a self down. It wouldn't. I don't think it would give me credit for any of it. Pretty sure. Heartbeat sensor would have been useful. Yeah, I should have picked up that heartbeat sensor to the to the side. Maybe that would have helped me track the people in the building. I might not have got might might not have got surprised. Stream sniped? I doubt it, Nick. I doubt it. I mean, what what are they trying to do? Like, make me... They're just trying to make... The only thing you could do to me is make me lose too early. I'm ultimately planning to lose the match. Yeah, he would be throwing the thermite on himself, Crocutter. That's That's how I think about it, anyway. Dominican will not compete against Jam. I actually, 
I actually would be interested to see what happens in the event that someone ties for first place. Because I think that rarely happens. In most normal... T Ooh, free loadouts. I'm going to have to... I'm going to pick whichever loadout... There's a... This one's going to fly this way. It might drop a loadout over there, maybe? I'm actually going to hover in the flight path of this plane and try to get a loadout. So next one's going to be about there. Maybe in the in the football field or thereabouts. Yeah, straight on the football field. Maybe I could... Yeah, I'm going to stretch to the one in the football field. It's going to take a while to actually land, though. That's the problem. I don't know if anyone's going for it. Oh, crap. Hey, bro. Chill, 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 chill. Okay, never mind. I did not see this guy coming at all. I, I literally looked around and didn't see anyone, but I guess he came from the wrong angle or something, or I'm blind. If I'm lucky, I might get an AFK. I might get an AFK gulag. I feel like I, feel like I might have died around the same time that the AFKs might have dropped. Like it's okay. This guy's not. They're, these two guys aren't AFK. All right. I'm sorry. Don't worry about it, looter. He literally said, "I'm sorry." The first people to enter get. Oh, okay. So that's 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 the uh, that's the tie break. Okay. Hey, Pro Rock, do you wanna do you wanna team up in this gulag? You want to team up in the gulag, bro? Bye, Pro Rock. Man, I made 10 grand from that gulag. $10,000 from a gulag. That's the new meta, guys. Guy died on this loadout, but I think that was the only guy there, so... I don't know. It's... I feel like the loadouts are actually very likely to get camped. So, now that I have money, maybe I should just buy a loadout. I'm not going to risk it. Hey guys, I think the, the meta might be immediately going to the gulag and getting getting money for a loadout in the gulag. Lovely jubbly. Okay. So what we can do is we can go back to that loadout. We can actually scope it out with the drone and we'll know if anyone's actually camping it or not. We could even use a heartbeat sensor. The new meta. <laughs> yeah. It's the new meta. Go, go to the gulag. The, the dying and going to the gulag meta. Gulag's the best place to loot. Don't don't land in a house. Land in the gulag. Loot the gulag. Ooh, free self revive. Everything's coming up. Millhouse. Um, I might just not bother with the drone. Well, I got space. Why not? Why not? Why not? Now I'll uh. I'll hold on to this uh, trophy system because it might save me from a thermite. I guess all I really want now is a gas mask. I don't have money for it. Don't need that loadout. Um, wait for the next circle and then I'll make a big move into the middle of wherever that next circle is going to be. Alright, pull to me. Maybe I want to go over there or something. Might actually just be worth moving to a drone. Like, that's kind of central, and there's a drone. I don't... This area, I feel, is kind of hot. Near that drone, it's very open. Loads of little houses. People love to camp these houses. And it's very open. So this drone, I, th I feel like it's pretty fraught. Pretty fraught situation. I wish there were a drone in the middle of this circle, but there's not. I could go... I could go hang out near this 
this one I could go loot these buildings. Probably find a gas mask or something. Cargo is kind of busy most of the time. There's going to be someone in one of these buildings. I feel like this area might be quiet. I'm going to head over here. We'll just loot up a little bit. Do some looting. Ooh. Don't mind me, bro. There's a guy coming in. Hello at the fire station. Can you hear me, dude? Would you buy me a gas mask and just leave it at the buy station, please? Thank you. I that guy's probably can't hear me. EU lobbies don't have Crocs chat enabled. They don't they don't talk. No one talks back. Ooh, another gulag entry. Maybe I should maybe I should let this guy kill me so I can go to the gulag and get even more money. It's the meta, guys. Going to the gulag is the new meta. Run around, grab money, hit the zip, get out. Farm smokes. Oh, that's a good point. There we go. I'll keep one equipped at all times so that I can I can throw them in an emergency. But I don't want to have two. Thanks for the uh, reminder, no one. No, please don't die again. But it's the meta. Going to the gulag is the meta. Do I need a plate box? Okay, you know what? Screw the heartbeat sensor. I'm going to carry plates. The heartbeat sensor might be a crutch that's a bit too distracting as well. Like, if I'm if I'm just caught short sitting in a corner looking at my heartbeat sensor, I, I don't have my shield up. Because if you look at the heartbeat sensor, it kind of lowers your shield. Oh, crap. Some guy's stunning, bro. Some guy's stunning and brave. I do not want to deal with that. Time to go for a swim. A little swam. A little swam a lamb a ding dong. I expect you to make a YouTube short out of that. Oh, you mean going go to the gulag? <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe we could do that. The new meta is going to the gulag. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That dude is straight up following me, bro. Or at least, like, not like following, following, but like he's he's following me with his eyes. I feel like he's waiting for me to pop up and he's going to shoot me again. Oh, he's got a ski do. He's following me. He's on land. He followed me. He threw, an, he threw another stun at me that completely missed miles away. He's miles away from me. T time to zip up here and just leave everything behind. I don't want to go to the fire sale by. Is there a zip line? I don't know. I'm wary this guy might just be hardcore chasing me. Yep, he is. Of a sketchy situation. Yeah, this guy is this guy's hard focusing me, man. Ooh, temper. That'll make the plates go real far. Is that a buy station in there? It is. Pity I don't really need it for anything. I do want to head north. Gone, I've gone far east enough. I want to go sort of towards the towards the cargo port area. All right, let's let's go here. Tall, bu big building, lots of dark corners, and a drone right next to it. Fire sales over. Oh my prices. gosh! Got. So many people shooting. Who knew that getting zero kills on a loss will put you in such sweaty SBMM lobbies, dude? 
Like, what is wrong with SBMM at this at this at this point? Wee. Maybe he stopped trying to shoot me. I don't know. There's a UAV on me. I don't know if uh, there's anyone in the cargo that might be waiting for me. I want to get in this building somewhere. Pretty sure up this these stairs there's just a room with like filing cabinets I can just blend in with. So we fine. Like, can I get on top of these? No. Can I get on top of these? No. I can't just hide in the corner. But we, this is a situation like we were in before. Where we've got this line of sight, this door, and this one. And I can't cover both with my shield. So, so I might be looking at this door and then someone comes from my left. So, ooh, is there a smoke? That was a flash. I thought that was a smoke. Uh, this this side is even better because I got one and two. Those are the only ways that an enemy can come. And I can just... They're both in front of me. So I'm just going to sit here. Now we're fine. Um... There we go. We'll start farming up to have like three stacks of smokes. All good. UAV. You, there's, there is a UAV up. Someone knows that I'm here. Uh, running after a riot shield is the opposite of what I do in solos. I mean, if you're anticipating that I'm going to kill... Like, what you, you don't want to end up in a 1v1 against a riot shielder, right? You, you kind of want to get them out of the game early, right? So I, I completely understand the impetus to try and focus the riot shielder and kill them early because you don't want to you don't want to lose the 1v1 in an open circle with, like, no cover. I have a baby monitor. I lost, I, I dropped the, the heartbeat sensor. I don't, I don't really need it. Oh, I don't want the thermite, dude. Um, there we go. Just gonna be stacked up on smoke. Jam, have you tried the new YouTube Shorts live streaming? I haven't seen it. No, uh, I haven't done it. Um, I have seen it though. I've like I've heard of it. Um, I haven't watched any of it. I honestly, I kind of don't really get like t TikTok live streams. Yeah. And YouTube Shorts live streams? I don't really, um... I sort of, I, I can't believe that anyone would sit, like, it's the opposite of short form content, right? Like, in on TikTok or YouTube Shorts, you're just swiping through stuff after a few seconds or, like, at maximum a minute for a, a short. So it seems weird to put infinitely long streams in the same feed. Uh, so I don't really get it. Maybe I'll try it. Maybe I'll try it once. And I'll, that, that'll help. So I'll actually make up my mind about, you know, is there an audience here? Is it worth it? Is it like, is it a really bad format? Because like you have to vertically trim your video. I don't know. We'll have to see. Maybe doing it, maybe streaming both at the same time might be possible. I don't know. Seeing some live streams hit 3K, and then when I want a better view, I watch the real stream and it's 300. Hmm, interesting. Interesting. Well, I suppose it's, it would probably be... I know there are a lot of YouTube channels who are shorts. They're, they're, they're primarily short channels, right? So they might have a like 100,000, 500,000, a million subscribers because they, they've been putting out loads and loads of shorts, but their long form videos, like their 10 minute actual videos only get like a thousand views or something because their audience, their audience is just a short form shorts content audience, right? So they're a big channel, but they're a big shorts channel. And those people might not, those channels probably struggle to get long, like people in their YouTube streams because that's even longer. But if they stream to the shorts feed, it probably is really great for them. But since I don't really have a big shorts audience, like my shorts don't get huge views, I think. I'm not, I'm not really sure. I haven't paid attention. Sometimes they they blow up. It seems kind of, seems kind of hit and miss. I don't, have a, I don't have an established huge audience on shorts, so I doubt there's much demand for me to do a shorts stream. I don't know. 
I don't know. I haven't tried it, so I basically don't have a really, really informed opinion. Any plans to take part in YouTube boxing? No, no plans at all. Ooh, footsteps. Someone zipped up somewhere. Okay, this is the situation we were in before. No UAV up. Okay, he's on the roof and he just sniped that guy out the window. Oh, I just heard it. He, he, I just saw his UAV pop. His UAV's on me. You're losing ground. Move it. Where do I go if this guy comes in here? Still on zero damage. Ugh. Where do I go on... I guess we'll... I'll, I'm gonna hope that it's a hard pull. Ooh, guy, guy on top of me just got, just got... um He got downed and he's gonna get finished with the airstrike, maybe. I just heard him get downed. Player count didn't go down. I think he must have self-rezzed. Maybe got, maybe the airstrike missed him. Yeah, he's, he's, still, he's still up there. Counter UAV up. Okay. He's looting. He probably doesn't know I'm here or he'd be trying to deal with me first before looting. Or he's bad. I don't know. He might be a bad, bad player. I don't know. All right. Waiting for the next circle to appear. Then I'm going to go outside, use the drone to wherever... Hopefully, in the next circle, there's a somewhere better to go. Because right now, the middle of this circle is looking pretty grim. I'm hoping it pulls hard to me or anywhere else but the middle. I guess if it's in the middle, I could just go here. But we'll wait and see. going yeah we could just go into my just go into this crappy little apartment building whoa wish I had mountaineer That's something I should be probably using more all right this is fine This is not a good spot because I got two doors to either side of me. What we could do? Enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Open the door from the in. Oh, see what I did there? I just pushed the door in, and now I can sit behind it, and I'm I'm hidden. Ten remaining. Keep pushing. Ooh. Don't mind me, bro. No! How is he? I'm behind him and he's shooting me. I'm behind. Like, did you guys see that? I bet. I bet. I bet. I bet. I bet. I turned to my, my back to him. Yeah, look at that. Look at that desync there, bro. That's insane. I should. I shouldn't have run up there. I thought there was only one guy in the building, but there was two. I should have noticed that there was a difference between the two skins. Oh well. That's, that's a skill issue on my part. Jude says, well, thank you for the 499, says, how much donation to get a kill? Um, I mean, I hesitate to say, like, I'm never going to get a kill, but I mean, everyone has their price. Um, I don't know. I mean, right, right now, I don't want to derail the objective of the game, so I, I'm just gonna say I'm not gonna get a kill. I'm gonna, I'm avoiding kills at all costs. Timothy is just tuning in. Okay, so for anyone who is just tuning in now, I will rehash the tournament rules, the tournament scoring here. Okay, so switching over. This is the Sunday Funday Pacifism Battle Royale Solos one day tournament on repeat.gg. $100 prize pool. Crucially, kills are punished with minus 20 points, right? So you don't want any kills. Damage is also penalized. 
Um, placement is the only way to get points. You fourth or fifth, you get 80, 80 points. Sixth, seventh, eighth, you get 60 points. Second or third, you get 120 points. And un unusually, uh, you, you'd expect you get the most points for first place, but you get zero points apparently for no, for, for no apparent reason. My theory is that they do not want to incentivize, like if, if they made it like, you know, 120 points for first place, then people would kill the last guy and get a hundred points. And they take the, they take the loss, they take the, the hit of minus 20 points for that one kill and get a hundred placement points. So they, they, I think this is a slightly ill-conceived Ill attempt to set the incentives correctly to make it a pacifism run. They probably what they probably should have done is give maximum placement points for first place as normal, but severely penalize kills with like two thousand points or something, so that it's just there's no recovering from even a single kill. That's how I would do it, but that's not how they've done it. So we actually do not want first place because that's zero. We just want second or third place for the maximum of 120 points. That is the situation. Uh, and now we are back to the game. It is a little bit weird. It seems like a, maybe a bit of an oversight. I'm not sure. Let's go to the bank. Jam working on a no-kill nuke bomb. This is the opposite of a nuke. It's a no no kill loss bomb. That's not is that the bank? Yeah, there's the bank. How about only execution kills? Uh, I guess I could do that with like stuns and stuff. Yeah. So the counter at the bottom of the screen is I've already got a, two perfect games where I came second place with zero damage. Um, and that'll grant me the, a perfect score of 120 points. So if I can do that five total times, three more, I will, um, I'll basically guarantee myself first place. Because no one can beat me. Pretty durable, that's nice. Jude, thank you for the 499. I'm very happy you deflected that question of how much for a kill. I'll stop trolling and ask again much later. <laughs> Alright, thank you, Jude. My motivations for sort of what I do in game are usually what I think the the, the master variable is what would be fun. Well actually I, I guess these are two I don't know which one's the master variable. What would be fun to watch and what would be fun for me to do? I think it's really what will be fun for me to do as a challenge or what will be fun for me to make a video about that. So strictly speaking, it's not what will be fun to watch because may maybe my tastes aren't the same as the audience's, right? But I think je there's there's obviously some significant overlap in the ki something I think is fun to make a video about, like a fun concept and what's fun to watch. Um... So right now, I think most people have tuned in to sort of watch this, watch me utterly pervert Warzone by streaming zero kill losses all day. And uh, like, that's the joke, right? The joke is I'm going for zero kill losses. And, uh, go oh crap. Don't mind me, guys. Fight amongst yourselves. Maybe I just go up the crane. Get some altitude. Drift over somewhere else. Yeah, I think if I if I went for a kill now, it sort of spoiled the joke. Drop as men as much as the tournament awards. I don't know what you mean, McDonald's. Um, Secret Dance Move says I was making Oppenheimer references, seeing as you were a physicist. You're both physicists. Yes, I'm a physicist. A nuclear physicist at the CERN Nuclear Research Facility. 
at Geneva, in Geneva in Switzerland. That's me. We're both nuclear. We're not just both physicists. We're both nuclear physicists. Although, technically, my research was on the electro-weak sector, not the strong force. So it's not really like nuclear physics. It's more like, oh, crap. It's more just like weak force decays. Okay, I'm going all in on this buy station, risking my life. Bro, bro, bro. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Hope that doesn't land on the bus and kind of get stuck. That's exactly what I was hoping wouldn't happen, dude. All's well. I don't... Before you guys ask, I do not know how to build a nuke. Uh, didn't know you were a nuclear physicist. Well, my training and, and my undergrad master's was... I was I got a master's degree in theoretical physics with like no lab work. I, I just didn't like being in the lab at all. If you Google the Pauli effect, uh, you'll understand something about how theoretical physicists do not like lab work. That's the Pauli effect, P-A-U-L-I effect. Um, that's not a real physics phenomenon. It's a description of a theoretical physicist called Wolfgang Pauli, who had a, almost a magical ability to make experiments fail simply by being in the room. Um, theoretical physicists and experiments don't mix. Uh, unfortunately, the Atlas experiment at CERN, the experiment I worked on, is a big physics experiment. So I wasn't as good at experimental physics as I was as an undergrad theoretical physicist. But then I suppose Oppenheimer is more of a theorist? Obviously, he led a project, a practical project, to build a real, real bomb in real life. So, that's pretty applied physics to me. All right, let's uh, let's find some let's find some crevice to hide inside. Oh, I hear footsteps. Ugh. I don't know, where's it? I, I want a dank corner. I want like a dark spot. Maybe we gotta go in here. So this, okay, up, you know, upstairs in this little room on the next floor. There's gotta be a dark, dark corner. Buy station on up over there, but I don't really need one. There we go. This this will be fine, I suppose. When are you doing the nuke? As soon as I unlock the contract, no one. I saw on Warzone Mythbusters it can kill. It just takes 10 shots. Ooh. I don't know. I, I kind of panicked through the trophy in case he was going to Semtex me in the back. I should have held on to that trophy. Because then he can actually stick me with it, and then I can throw the trophy yeah, and save myself. Relocating the safe zone. This guy is this guy's pre-aiming me through walls, dude. Like he might have a heartbeat sensor. He 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 basically came around that corner knowing exactly where I would be. Kinda of, kinda of weird. Kinda of weird. Kind of a weirdo. 
Bro, he's chasing me, dude. Enemy soldier incoming. I wonder. Oh, crap. I wonder if anyone with war hacks. Oh, crap. Damn, bro. Fair enough. This guy wasn't having any nonsense, dude. I didn't realize that he was right out. He was right outside looking through that window. Fair enough. I wonder if there's ever been anyone with wall hacks in one of my lobbies who saw my username and recognized me and deliberately sought me out. I wonder if that's ever happened. Hello, Clay Carter. How you doing, bro? How you finding the game so far? How you doing, bro? Alright, fair enough. No one talks back. And I, I was I was desperately looking for a second smoke there. I, if I knew there was only one smoke... I, I had the one smoke I spawned with. I was looking for a second one. I, I probably should have saved that one smoke. I shouldn't have pushed. Um... Breakpoint. There's no UAV. There's no. There's a red square around the map. I kept checking the map to see if that guy had a UAV, and he, uh, I can, you, you can you can see when there's a UAV. There's a red square on the map. But that's why I thought because he didn't. There was no UAV square. There was no UAV indicator on the map. I suspected he might have had a heartbeat sensor because he could still find me. Perfect ankle shots too. Yeah, I mean, it, it's if someone it, that aiming it, when someone someone deletes me by shooting at the legs, I kind of know they've got to be a decent player. Because if like aimbot would like struggle, wouldn't if you were a cheater with aimbot, they kind of can't stop aiming at the chest or the head or wherever they're locked onto. Personally, wish they went back to having ghosts working even when you're not moving. I can, um, I can sort of appreciate it. Like, um, it, I think it would be nice if there was some kind of really high investment. Like, like maybe if you had a stealth vest and ghost at the same time, then you get like mega ghost, right? So you need you need like a really it's, it's a really high bar to get perfect super ghost all the time. That would be kind of good. Um, I, I feel like having permanent ghost, it would be nice to have in the game as a kind of very, very rare, very strong or very costly option. But I think the game is... Pro probably plays a bit better with very weak ghosts. I think it's more popular. It's more fun for people because it's not fun to get shot in the back. Most people, most uses of ghosts are killing people, shooting them in the back when they don't know you're there. Um, and that's kind of not fun. A lot of people don't like that. So a big fat ghost nerf, it's probably good for the game. As much as it hurts me, like I would benefit from super ghost. Um, I can see why they would do it for the game. Can you shuffle a single card? Um, hmm. So, Neil, it depends what you mean by shuffle. Um... There's, okay, here, here's the crucial question. If, if you took a deck of cards, mixed them up, and they had the exact same original order after you shuffled them, is, is that, did you still shuffle them? Or like, if someone hands you a deck of cards, let's say you let's say someone loads a deck of cards in the way that benefits them, and then you say shuffle them, and 
they hand you the same deck of cards in the same order and they say, yeah, I shuffled them, bro. It's just chance that they ended up like that. Um, is that good enough to count as a shuffle? So the problem is, if you have one card, if, if, if we define shuffling as changing the order, well, I guess that's not, that's not shuffling because let's say you just reverse, or like shuffling is randomizing the order. And so if you randomize the order of two cards, there's two ways you can randomize it. If you randomize the order of one card, there's only one way you can randomize it. But you can probably, yeah, I'd say you can technically shuffle one card. There's just one way that it can be shuffled, I would say. Extremely unlikely to have the same order. Yes, like it's uh, yeah. The number of permutations of uh, of properly shuffling a deck of cards is like many times greater than the number of atoms in the universe. Such that if you shuffle a deck of cards properly, you almost certainly are the first person in human history to ever hold a deck of cards in that order, and you're and the and the last. Like there will never be a human who. Sh shuffles a deck of cards by pure chance in the same order as the one you just you just shuffled because there are just so many ways to shuffle a deck of cards like if you do it properly but yeah i mean and by properly i mean just if you, if you just truly randomize the order of a deck of cards once that's the first time it's ever been in that order i guess you could you i don't think you could you couldn't even It'll probably be too computationally intensive to even have like a video game poker game or something like virtually shuffle cards at super speed and go through like every permutation like even hold them in memory for a single millisecond and then keep moving because there's so many permutations it would take longer than the lifetime of the universe to go through them all I need to move out of, need to get away from the gas that's coming in real fast. Okay, bounty's averted. That's, that was the main thing I was worried about because I could, I heard a car come in and I knew I had, there was a bounty on me. So I was worried that there was a guy basically gatekeeping me from gas. Uh, we could head in towards this buy station near the drone, maybe get a loadout. Exhibit A, well, some people guess you're a professor. Professor of Gas at Warzone University. Thank you for agreeing with your friend. Well, what's your what's your counter argument, Neil? Like, what would you what was your argument against your friend? Because maybe you know, I, I'm open to discussing it. That there's probably some counter arguments. So your your friend said yes, you can shuffle it. There's only one way to shuffle it, and you said. No, because I guess is your is your position that sh shuffling requires change, and because you can't change the order, then you can't shuffle it. But my claim is that it is possible, just very unlikely, that you can properly shuffle a normal deck, and um, still get the same order of cards. Like that's possible. So, so unless you have some other discriminator that disqualifies one card from being shuffled. Oh, no, thank you. Whoa, this Giga Chad, absolute crack sniper. Phase Neo over here. Let's make sure I don't accidentally lose my smokes by throwing one of them. I wanted to hit this drone that's to my left, but I feel like I might die on the way, so I'm just going to have to leave. Ooh, passive. Passive is joining in. I want to know what happens um, if two people come first place. Because it shouldn't be too hard for two people to get a perfect score. Ooh, UAV's up. I hope. 
hope there's no one near the near the loadout with the UAV. I'm not even going to bother with that loadout. I kind of wanted to get it for for an extra smoke, but if it's if it's a faff to get to, go down the hill. I just don't want to bother, especially with a UAV up. Don't want to make myself vulnerable. I just want to hit a drone and get way ahead of the gas. I want to get in the middle. I don't want to have to deal with any of this nonsense. I think I'm going to... Bro, stow. There we go. I want to get a muni and a plate box. Oh, crap, dude. Who sniped me? Through the smoke, even. I guess he sniped me before. He sniped me before. What? I yeah, fair enough. He lined up his shot kind of before the smoke came in. Fair enough. Also, it could have been some smoke desync. Maybe on his screen the smoke wasn't in exactly the same spot or something. Good job to him. I think the fix. Okay, wait, Neil. I'm going to read your explanation after this. There's a smoke there, that's good. Albo Swiss Dreams, how's it going, bro? What kind of Swiss are you, bro? Schweizer Deutsch? See ya. I don't even know where he went. I think he might have been AFK or something, dude. Oh, my my stuff is probably completely lost, though, man. Oh, okay, maybe. Gas is coming in. My loadout's been eaten. It might be worth... Is that a person? I feel like this sniper, he's pretty good. He probably would have gone ahead rather than get l lollygaggle. Oh, crap. There we go. He was camping my body. Yeah, he's camping my body. Maybe he recognized my name. It was like, got to get him out of the lobby. I don't know. I guess, I mean, what, what could I have done there? I, I guess I could have been a bit more cautious. I could have landed on the roof of that building. Could have landed on the roof of that building and waited and like listened to see if there was anyone nearby. I could have waited until the gas came in and cleared off the area, but I didn't have stims on my body, so I couldn't really go in the gas any very long. So there's, I guess there's, I, I could have abandoned my body entirely and just started, tried to regain from scratch. But I think going back to my body wasn't, you know, it was a was a was a pretty good decision there. You know, it's it's certain it, it it certainly wasn't a clear decision. It was at best sixty forty one way or the other. But it was pretty fifty fifty whether it was a good idea or not. I think Jam Cow winning more gulags without fighting than most streamers do that fight. Yeah, that's like what seventy five percent win rate, seventy five percent gulag win rate. Not bad today. You would think tiebreaker would go to the guy who got the perfect score first. I believe that's sort of how it works, Jared. Uh, from what Dominican said, the tiebreaker is whoever joined the tournament first. So if Passive Puppet and me both get five games with a perfect score, so we both have top up five games with an average score of 120, I would, I think, out of the two of us, uh, win the tiebreaker because I joined the tournament earlier, which I guess kind of makes less sense. Because if you the earlier you join the tournament, you, the more time you have to rack up the games. Like if you joined, if you joined like right like in the like three hours before the tournament ends, and you just you only have three hours to get your five games, or two and a half hours, or even just two hours. Like you need to be perfect. Like for me, the longer you take, the worse you are. I think I'm 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 spending ages to get these these games, kind of.
Okay, so Neil's, Neil's, Neil's explanation. What's that? I think the fixed result dictates that you can't shuffle it. It also physically impossible. He's a math nerd physicist, so it's like playing tennis against the wall. Okay. Okay. So let's see. The the argument is is essentially a singularity at the one. So Neil, presumably you would agree that if there are two cards, you can shuffle two cards because you can physically swap them around. Like you can, you can move them around. You can shuffle two cards by just, ch you can change the order. But once it's down to one card, there is no transformation that can be applied to, um, to those two cards which change it which which changes their order right so your consideration is is the actual process of shuffling you're saying the process of physically shuffling a physical deck of cards can't take place with one card because there's only one card it can ha can take place with two three four or any number of cards above one right and i think your friend is thinking in the abstract that Can you, like, like, does that, like, simply does, in theory, does there exist an, any ordering of these cards, which, well, I guess your, your friend is probably thinking in theoretical terms, like, definitionally, can you, hmm. I think I'm I am sympathetic to your perspective Neil. I, I think if the question is can you can you sh Wait, why am I going backwards? I'm going the complete wrong way. I don't know. I don't know why I was looking that way. I was trying to go over here. I am I given that the question is can you shuffle something? Can you shuffle a single card? shuffling um well okay actually okay all right it depends i think i i think i might be able to connect you to it depends how you shuffle so imagine oh guys dropping in well i think what you're imagining is if you hold a deck of cards in your hand and you shuffle them what you're doing is you're basically moving the cards around right you're just kind of you're physically moving them around. You're you're revert. You're putting one in front of the other, right? And you can't really do that with one, with one card. So you can't shuffle it, right? When you're doing it on a computer, if you had, if you're playing a video game, video game poker or something, the cards are like a list. They're they're just a list of objects, like an array of cards or something like that. And if you were to recall some kind of randomization function, what that would do is essentially create a new list an empty list and then go through the first list with doing do a random number generation and select one card at a time from a random position in the first list and move it into the new list until the first list was empty and the, the second list is full and then you have a new random order of cards right and you could do that with a list of length one you do a random number generate like anything between you do a ra like you do whatever what basically you would have your random number generator, but whatever the result of that is, there's a 100% chance that the first and last and only card that you move from deck one into deck two is the one card. So you could do this in a, on a computer. So, and you can actually do this in, in physical space. Imagine the way that you shuffle the car, a deck of cards was you like, you take the deck of cards, you r rifle through it to a random spot, and then deal out that card onto a pile. And then you do it again. You rifle through the deck of cards, pick a random card, deal it on top of the first card. And you keep doing that until you have a new pile, which is completely randomized. That's one way you could shuffle a deck in physical space. And if that's how you're doing it, you could shuffle a single card by simply putting it down on the table. And you've, you've started and finished your shuffling in the exact same moment. So by analogy with how a computer would shuffle shuffle virtual cards, 
I think you, which you, I think you can emulate in physical space. I think that your friend, I think your friend is right, and you can shuffle a single card. But I'm completely sympathetic to your reasoning, Neil. Uh, I, I hope that maybe I can give you, like, so basically the way you would shuffle a single card in physical space is mentally frame it as picking a random card out of the deck one at a time to create a new deck and you only do that once if there's one card and it's over immediately but you could still do that process that makes sense Enemies dropping into the AO. Ah. this is the definitely the nerdiest warzone stream on the internet i think Heartbeat sensor. Already got heartbeat sensor. Ooh, this is kind of a dank room, actually. It's not a bad place to hide. Well, it's at the edge of the circle, but in terms of this building, let's see, is, is Neil still here? Or have I scared him off? Any set of two plus cards can be shuffled. The function of the shuffle is to randomize the outcome. Yeah, so Neil, I think, I, yeah, I, I think... If you imagine it in the abstract like a computer, then you can shuffle one card and you can sort of imitate an abstract shuffling in real space, in physical space. You can't physically shuffle it. Like just like in, with in one hand, but if you imagine creating a new pile, I think you can. That might be what your friend is thinking at least. What do I do? Uh, armor box. Armor box, maybe a muni. We'll be fine. You're losing ground. Move it. Okay, we'll just move, man. Just tuned in. What is a lost tournament? Okay. So, if you want a super detailed explanation, scroll way back to the very beginning of the stream. There's a full explanation there. I'm not going to hit that loadout because I think there could be people camping it. Full explanation right at the beginning of the stream. But, short... Uh, the short version of the events is that we're in a repeat.gg tournament where the only way to gain points is with placement. Oh crap, was this car coming for me? No. Kills and damage are both penalized, right? So you, you lose points for kills. But for some reason, only first and second place award placement points and sorry no only only second and only second third fourth fifth sixth up to eighth place award any placement points the maximum points you can get off a second or third place if you come first you get zero points and i think the reason that they that first place gives zero points is because they don't want people to just wait, get zero kills until the 1v1 and then kill the last guy because the kill penalty is minus 20, but the placement bonus would be like 120 or something. So they'd still get 100 points for coming first. So a lot of people would still kill the last guy and that kind of negates the point of pacifist. Thanks for the car, bro. Bye. Cutting off your nose to spite your face, bro. It's like, if I can't have the LTV, no one can. Is that a dead person down there or just like some random texture? I don't know. Just didn't that them I didn't even pop a tire, bro. I'm going the wrong way. Is there a gas? I can't, I, when I open the map, I can't turn left. It like forgets that my, my A key exists. 
Uh, we could go up here to this gas station, I suppose. Heal the car, maybe? I've still got my driver's side door, which will protect me. That's pretty good. So, so the way to get a perfect score, the perfect score in this is 120 points for second or third place with zero kills and zero damage. That's the best it gets. I've already done this twice. I'm trying to do this five times because it's the only games that count are your best five. If I can get five games, zero kills, second place or third place, I get a perfect score. Is there a smoke grenade in here? There is. Lovely jubbly. I don't really need to bother hitting this cash drop. I'm just gonna keep moving. Let's go over here, I guess. I think what I'll do actually, I'll there's like a zip line to the under. I'll, I'll actually hang out in the underground. I'll, I'm going to put my car on the on the above ground and then I'll camp near the zip line underneath. So I'm pretty sure there's like a zip line in here, right? There we go. If I drop down here, bro, that was that was sketchy, dude. Okay, yeah, we could just sit here. Is there a better place? Maybe even here. Just sit here. So no one's gonna find me down here. Very, or I could even get in this corner if I went behind the door. If I just slam it open secrete myself behind the door here perfect so i'll hide behind the door and i can zip up to the car if i want to if no one steals it yet no one's here Ugh. we can rotate we also have a drone up there if we really want it LTV might be your strategy. Yeah, it's it's pretty good for procrastinating in the final zone. It's just like hanging around. Keep a frag handy when you decide it's time to go. The way I've decided to do it is mol Molotov. I'm just going to Molotov my, my feet like that. Ooh, I dropped some fire on the ground. But I guess I, guess I could hold a frag and cook it. But I, I feel like Molotov's a bit more dramatic. So, uh, I'm actually amazed that we, we, we already have, like, over 200 likes um, from on a stream about zero kill losses. <laughs> like, like, there's, like, 222 lunatics and perverts have, have, like, the most perverted backwards Warzone stream in history where I'm not trying to win and I'm not trying to kill anyone. Like, <laughs> no one's ever done this before, as far as I know. No one's ever had a reason to. You got this jam, get the most zero kill losses. Thanks, God of Gas. Wasn't sure if the Molotov is enough. Yeah, it's totally enough. It'll also, it'll also, uh, the thing with the frag, right, is... A frag will down me, and then I would need to give up my self revive. The Molotov will, will automatically burn me as well, so it's actually easier to down and finish myself with a Molotov than a frag. Why not just ride the whole game? You have two left. Just go to the gas and die. Um, well, I, I don't want to. I don't want to attract too much attention with the LTV. I guess what we could do is we could go up. We could go park up next to the border, actually, and stay out in the stay kind of out in the open. Like just go park up here. That might actually be pretty good, because this circle.
This circle pr probably has a decent... Ooh. Yeah, see, this is why I don't... How is this guy hitting me? Is this guy cheating? No. I was thinking, like, he... he, he... I got two hit markers, but it barely did, like, one HP of damage. Which made me, like, think, like... Is this guy getting ricocheted or something? But then he started doing real damage, so... I think maybe he's legit. Maybe he, like, wall... Maybe he just hit the car and, like, wall banged me a little bit. So this is sort of what I want to do, I guess. Just, like, camp out at the edge of the map. Do some old-school, like, cargo truck camping. Anyone remember that from Verdansk? Well, war, like, wars of Verdansk solos was just truck zone <laughs> when the final zone was just like three dudes driving around in cargo trucks the most impregnable vehicle I don't want to run out of fuel though that's kind of a problem I don't know how long this is going to last is there another there's no other gas station I can really use maybe what I need to do is like okay I'm going to park just inside the zone. Oh, no, no, thank you. I'm going to park up here. And then I'm going to... You got a loadout drop inbound. I'm just going to... I'm going to conserve my fuel here. Wait, what? Pressing the wrong button. What is this? My ping wheel? I'm attacking here. Why is C pinging stuff? It's, I have P as my ping wheel. What the hell? Enemies are dropping into Ooh. the area. Watch the skies. Gas is inbound. Someone just get shot. I, I wanted to grab the get in the car in case this guy. I heard I heard guy dropping in. I didn't want him to like steal my car. But then he got shot and died, it seemed like. I don't know, bro. This takes me back to Verdansk, actually. Like, back when I was really struggling to just win a game of solos, I would keep just, like, abusing the cargo trucks and waiting for final zone. And just using the, th the third-person camera to look around. You entered as well, God of Gas? Good luck. I don't... I think this is kind of a nice little cliff to be on, right? I don't think anyone's going to come up here. I, I, I think that I think I'm kind of clear on this side. The problem is... I could get sniped through this little window, like my head is, expo is exposed. Someone straight in the zone could snipe me, so maybe I want to just point my little tuckus straight in the zone, and they can't because they can't shoot me through the back here. As long as no one comes around either side, they can't shoot me. It's so probably be fine. Point point my butt into the zone. Point my bulletproof backside. This ping is like really lasting a long time. I thought that would expire. I think no one's coming from this side. We're, we're fine. Still eight people alive, though. We need five more to die before we get perfect score. You asked Nick Marx and he ended stream? Like, he, you asked him about the, sh the card shuffle and he just ended the stream. I don't know. He... Nick Mux doesn't strike me as the type of dude to get nerd sniped very easily. Oh, there's this. Okay, I, mean, I don't. I don't want to. I'm gonna see if I can just <laughs> take cover behind this tree from this guy. I still got pretty, pretty, pretty decent health on this car actually. Like I'm, you know, look, the LTV is not taking very much damage at all. Am I in? No, I'm not. I'm going to have to move, get around this tree just to get inside. 
How did that guy did that guy jump off to get to the the cash box? Why are you what the heck is that? Oh, some guy sent a breacher drone. I heard a little a little buzz. Is there a guy behind those rocks or something? Oh, there is. There's a guy. There's a guy right there. There's a guy. I can see his feet peeking out. He's just like prone. And he sent a breacher drone at my car. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Um, I was gonna. If if it was the top three situation already, I would offer this guy a ride. I don't want to take the risk right now. I think there's someone over by this cash box because he. He flew across. There's no safe direction. I'm, I'm vulnerable to the left and right. Here. Like, I'm vulnerable for the, the sides of my car are vulnerable. Oh. All right, top three situation. Who wants a lift? Who wants to get on the back of my car? Hey, blue guy, you want to get on the back of my car? Get on the back. Go in the back, dude. Do you want to go? Who wants to go in the back, dude? Who wants a free UAV? Why can't Why can't I honk my horn, dude? I'm pressing my. Oh, I, it's not. It's unbound. I used to be able to just press F. Hello, bro. Hello. GG's, GG's, Spencer. Strategy, yeah. I'll tell you one thing, yeah? I'll tell you one thing. Your strategy is shit. Your well, strategy, my strategy is shit, bro. But I came Trust second. Me. I wanted Your to come second. Shit, bro. I, just I didn't want to win. Bro. I literally destroyed go you. Go Google my name. <laughs> Woo. 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 What a shitty strategy is that, bro? Like, you don't know what I'm trying to do, bro. <laughs> <laughs> don't offer nothing, you'll kill someone. Why don't the other guys not try to win? It's not a custom lobby. That's a so we got it. That's 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 a, that's a third one. Spencer, are you there, bro? Spencer. Spencer. Can I type? Wait, what the? I can't type in the match chat. What the hell? That's a shame. Oh, well, he, he only, he didn't speak until he got me down. He didn't have the courage to speak until he got me down. That's, uh, that takes the sting out of his bragging, I guess. Like, if he called it, if he said, that you're trash, I'm going to kill you, and then he killed me. Like, if he's, if he was trash talking, then I would, like, maybe try to, try to win, right? Just to, just to teach him a lesson. But I didn't know he was going to be toxic. He didn't start being toxic until he'd already won. Which is a kind of cowardice, I think. Damn, dude, you're a problem. <laughs> it also, that means he must have had, um, he must have had uh, Prox chat on. So he heard me offering a lift, right? He heard me, like, trolling around. He heard me messing around. So there's no way, uh, there's no way he thinks I was trying my hardest. Jam truly won. Yeah, he, he didn't, he didn't win any money from that. But I, I've got some prize money coming. <laughs> Howdy, Helio Murata. How you doing? I mean, to to be fair, uh, he's he probably doesn't win that much, so he's probably really happy. He's probably he's probably really happy to get the win. So we we both won there actually. He he got the win he really wanted, and I got the second place I really wanted. Only two more to go. That's another perfect score. Perfect score, zero kills, zero damage, second place. I think every single time we've actually come second place as well. Like, we could, could we could just come third place. It's easy. I guess what would have been fun in that situation is burn myself. Like, just, like, die deliberately. Um, 
that that would confuse him at least. He wouldn't think that he beat me. I should I should have just I should have just down, I should have just uh killed myself. I'm gonna get demonetized for that. Sound like a streamer. That's uh yeah he could he could he actually had a pretty good mic Ashlyn. Maybe he maybe he was streaming. I don't know. What was his name? Do we know his name? Spencer. What was his name? A.K. Spencer. I'm gonna look look this guy up. Was he? He had a nice mic. A.K. Spencer with a double S. Just open, just go on Twitch. Why is everything caps lock right now, dude? A.K. Spencer. I'm just gonna do it real real quick. Ooh, there is a streamer called. Spencer, Warzone 4.8 KD, like this guy here, this dude right here, Spencer, he's offline right now, but uh, who knows, who knows if, the, if, who knows if it's the same guy, over. Stand by for to the war zone. I don't think he's, he hasn't streamed in a while, ooh, his streams are actually unlisted, but potentially accessible, so I might be able to open up his stream and see. Like an old stream and see if it was actually him. On and live is not a word. Yeah. I, I don't like... I, I find this... I'm a, maybe I'm too much of a boomer to... Uh, to have adapted to this modern self-censorship -censor lingo. I think he might be. I think this might be him. TTV... Spencer, S P N S S Pen S S A R. Never mind. I uh, can't actually see any of his past videos, so I I was trying to open it and see if his in-game username was A K Spencer. I want to communicate to him that like we both got we were what we wanted. We weren't adversaries there. He he was treating me like an adversary, and it hurts, right? He's saying like your strategy's terrible. He thinks I'm a really bad enemy, but I'm actually. He thinks I'm a really unskilled enemy that he defeated. But he, well, I'm actually a really skilled uh, ally of his. Right? I, 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 we're both on the same team. He just doesn't know it. I want to reassure this, this fellow. Okay, let's get rid of this. We don't need any of that nonsense. Two left. Two left until we get a perfect score. Ooh, a muni. Ooh. Enemy soldier? Where? God, like, they need to give that warning maybe earlier or something so that they're still in the air and you can see them. I, I couldn't even hear anyone. Like, no parachute noise or anything. Weird. He wasn't live though. Yeah, he definitely isn't live right now. But he, like, if it's him, I could still type in the chat. And be like, Spencer. Spencer, rest assured. Oh, someone's, someone's running around nearby. I heard some footsteps. I don't know where exactly. Rest assured, Spencer. You only saw me because I wanted to be seen. You only killed me because I wanted to die. If I wanted to win, you would have never seen me at all. All you would have seen is the gas closing in. That sounds reassuring, right? Right, guys? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm just going to swim away with no plates, get shot in the butt. This guy's definitely going to push me, right, and shoot me in the water. Is he coming? Where? Is he fighting someone else? I don't know. I don't know what's happening. He's not. It doesn't seem like he's shooting at me. Whoa! No thanks. Back in the water we go. I'm not gonna go on land. We're just gonna go the long way around. Perks not working. Says. Oh, um, I think that command might not be defined yet. Are 
You didn't put DMMB because you kill people with mines. Okay, fair enough. His name was AK Spencer. That is true. Hugh Manson Warner. But the Twitch name, I think, is just Spencer. Of a streamer who does stream Warzone. But I can't can't see any of his past VODs yet. I tried loading one from the uh, from the archives, but it's not loading yet. How did I how did I go through a single door and it made two slamming noises twice? I guess I could get a loadout. I kinda don't want to invest in a loadout until I have at least plates on my body to keep myself alive. Right, now that now it's okay, I suppose. Ooh. Loadout drop in Ooh, a smoke as well. Splendid. Oh, load. Uh, I'm going to go for the loadout then. We'll go to a buy station some other time. I, there's a UAV up, so I'm a little bit concerned. I want the shield on my back ASAP, and I certainly don't want to go to a buy station and make myself vulnerable. Ooh. Enemy loadout. Oh, UAV's expired, or maybe I moved out of range. So maybe it's that guy way back, way back where I just came from. Because I, because I moved in, I kept moving away from him towards my loadout. He might have popped a UAV. Ooh, free gas mask. I'm gonna dump this out because I, I don't want to even use this cluster strike by accident in case it does damage. Uh, we'll pop this for the extra smokeroonies. All I need, really, is a self-revive. Go check out this buy station. Free sent. Oh, what we, we could... We could... Hit this buy station. Oh, sniper. No, don't want to deal with him. See ya. Hello up there, Mr. Snipey Boy. Perry Escobar. How goes it? What? We versus all. We versus what? Okay, I'll drive. I'll drive. There's a car, okay? I, I have no gun, you see? No gun. I don't shoot. Here. Okay. Here's the gun. Get, get in I the car. Get. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa. Whoa. Let's go, Perry. Whoa. You gotta get on the on the back, on top. On the, on the okay. Back. Yeah, yeah. Let's go, Perry. Let's go, Perry. Um. Yeah, yeah. So fast. Yeah. Where are you from, Perry? Where are you from, Germany? I'm from Germany. Oh, Germany. Ich kann ein bisschen Deutsch sprechen, aber ich habe viel vergessen. Ich habe es in die Schule gelernt. Uh, my English is not good. Okay, this is, is better than my, my, my Deutsch, I think. My Deutsch, das Auto yeah, is very, <laughs> wie sagt man, fast schnell. auf Deutsch. Schnell, schnell. schnell. Of course, genau. schnell. Oh, let's just go. Let's go to the Zentrum. Zentrum. Yeah. Let's go to the center. Where's the, there's no uh, bridge. Wiesagmann Bridge auf Deutsch. Brücke. Brücke. Was? Brücke. 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 Ja, genau, Brücke. Okay, wir. Wir geht. Wir gehen. Wir fahren, wir fahren auf die Brücke. Wir fahren auf die Brücke. Der Brücke. Genau. Die Brücke. Die Brücke. Genau. <lacht> Ein kleiner Deutschkurs. <lacht> so. So right yet, right right now, I'm I want second place. Ich ich will uh, Zwitter. I don't I don't want to win. I'm in a tournament. First place is zero points. 
First okay, place okay. is zero points, and second place is 120. So I want second place. So if you, if we uh, get if we get to if top we get, two, if we get to top two, then I just wanna I just wanna yeah, die, just wanna, and then die. you can win. Okay. Okay. Good. I have zero kills as well. I'm not, I, I can't kill anyone. I have five kills. Okay, cool. My stream chat is telling me the, how to say bridge is Die Brücke. Die Brücke. Right, they're, yeah. they're spelling it for me, Die Brücke. And we must go here on the dach, on the dach. High ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. High ground. Hoch. Let's go. Let's get hoch. Let's get high together, bro. I'm on the. I'm on top. Ich bin hoch. Ooh, there's someone okay. here, maybe. Here's jemand. Here's jemand. Yeah. Ich denke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Ich bleib, ich bleib stille. Ich bleib still. Ich auch. Ich höre nichts. Oh, bomb drone. Okay, okay. I'm on top. It's me. I'm moving. I'm, I'm on, I'm on top. This is me. I'm on the roof. Oh, niemand. No, no niemand, people. niemand. No, okay, no, 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 no people. Keine Leute. No, Keine Leute no, ist hier. Keine Leute, Keine Leute sind hier. No, that, that's good. sehr gut. I, I have a sniper. Okay, nice. I'm gonna hide in the dark. In der, der Dunkel. Ja. Dunkelheit. Dunkelheit. In der Dunkelheit, ja. Ich bin jetzt in der Dunkelheit. Ja. Ja, sieht man dich nicht. Don't see you. Hab, hast du Geist? Ich kann nicht. Ähm, ich nee, habe einen. Geist habe ich nicht. Ah. Ich, Oder doch Geist habe ich. ich ha ja. Ah, okay. Okay, hier, hier. I don't, I don't see you on uh, heartbeat, on your heartbeat sensor. Oh. This guy is cool. He's a lot of people here. I'm not married, Jack, but I have a long-term girlfriend, Jamie G. Bro, pretty good German too, to be honest. Just out of curiosity, how many languages do you speak? Depends what your standard is, Alexander, I guess. English, French, German, a little bit of Mandarin Chinese. And like, you know, what? Like, if you can say a sentence in Spanish, does that mean you can speak Spanish? I, I, I can't, I don't consider myself speaking Spanish. Or Italian, just because I can say a few tourist phrases. Oh, mortar strike. Ich geht ins Auto. Oh. Ist das du? Hallo. Fahren wir. Schnell, schnell. Fahren wir ins nach Low Lowstadt. Low Town. Ja, ja, ja. Es gibt ein UAV. Oh no, Perry. Perry's gone. Perry jumped out. What's happening? Perry. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to get hit by the train here. I might die. Come, Perry. I can't kill. No Come. kill. No kill for me. I don't want to. I don't want to kill. I. 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 I want no kills. I think he was. He was trying to. He was trying to give me the kill, man. He's trying to help me get a kill. Perry, he's inside. I think he's inside the inside inside the building. Oh no 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 you're not. Nice. Nice 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 nice. He dead. I'm so good. Let me get some armor. 
There we go. Oh. Noise. Come to me, come to me. Yep. Go out of the car. Oh, uh, ich, uh, ich hab, ich hab, ich hab ein selbst, selbst revive already. Oh, another car, ein anderes Auto. Schnell! Fight, 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 fight! Yeah, get him! <laughs> I'll try to get, uh, I'll try to get next to him. Three cars. So many cars. I think this guy got out of the car. Whoa! I got stuck with a thermite through the car? What the crap? This car might explode and kill me, dude. Bro! I can't believe that! I couldn't... I needed to self-revive. I needed, couldn't get away from the car. If I... I should have taken the, the extra self-revive. It would have saved my life, bro. The extra self-revive would have saved my life. I should have taken that self-revive from him, bro. I can't believe I got stuck with the self with a thermite in the car. What the hell, bro? Still zero damage. Still did so don't worry, John. I think people were worried he might have got damaged by the car. He didn't get damaged. That's insane, bro. <laughs> that was, okay, free, free gulag. Okay, we just land 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 on uh, land on my body. Shouldn't be too hard to get my stuff. Me oh, there, there, there's, there's, that's my stuff. Everything should have survived. Perry! Perry, hello, Perry, 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 hello, Perry. Bro. The, the shield is not working, bro. Yeah, come to me. I'm, I'm, I'm dead on the house. Come to me. Okay, I'm, I'm in the smoke. Okay, I'm gonna get on the back. I'm on uh, I can't. I can't. Oh, I got. Oh, that's that's not that's not Perry. I thought he was in the car. I thought that was Perry in the car, bro. I thought he was gonna pick me up. No. <laughs> when the car didn't initially run you over, you should have probably just kept reviving. Well, I didn't know how long it was gonna last until it blew up. I, I, I wanted to wiggle away from it, but then as I wiggled, I thought I'd like run out of, I like, I was about to die, I was about to bleed out. I don't know. I think that was just a kind of all round tough situation. Should we, do we want to watch this out? Do we want to see what happens to Perry? Bro got wrecked by a one in five billion trick shot. Yeah, that sticking me with a thermite through the wind, through the window of the car. Like I, that one, that that one thermite that screwed me over. There's nothing you can do. I didn't get run over, pure blood. That was the car exploding. Like the car got disabled and was like on fire, and I, I could and so it was giving me damage into like threat indicators that the car was about to explode. That's why I was trying to crawl away from it, but I didn't really have the time to crawl away because I would have bled out, and I also was worried about getting thirsted. I wanted to med vest would have saved me there. I think. I could have revived faster and moved away from the car before it blew up. I want to switch, switch views here. I, I want to. I want Perry. Perry said he has a sniper, so this might be Perry. I want to see if Perry can kill this Scopix guy. Hey, maybe we get a jailbreak. I saw a clip on Reddit of like a final circle jailbreak. I think that might be mini duos though. Jam too much trolling. Get the dub loss, man. <laughs> Thank you for the ten dollars, Dominican. We gotta have fun. If we, if all we're going for is zero kill loss, we gotta do something to have fun on the way. In the end, I did. Oh, like the yeah. I mean, it's all getting it's all getting killed by the car one way or another. Oh, Dominican, you got you got the dub. You accidentally won, Dominican. You suffering from success? Oh, that's him. <gasps> this is Perry. This is Perry. It's a rev revive off with Perry. Is that that's Perry? Sure. Is that Perry? Please tell. No, it's, his name is Fuxi or something. 
Okay, I thought I thought it was the same skin as the as my friend. No, <laughs> Perry. No, no. Okay, no, he got no, he got third party. So Perry's still alive, I think. Perry just got saved by this guy. So what happened is we were watching a sniper, right, who downed Perry, and then this guy Fuxy downed the the guy who attacked Perry, and so and Perry finished the the guy who downed him so perry's still alive somewhere i think judging by the skin i think i recognize the skin unless i'm like unless i'm going crazy i think he's still alive somewhere so there's a chance there's a chance that perry could win this brave mosquito drone yeah that's the, he's kind of he's kind of screwed there very tough situation for this fuchsy guy Oh, he, he, he might he's, he might be able to get this res off here. No more smokes to cover himself, though. Oh, he got he got wrecked. Okay, top three. Guy called Broken. The chances of us running into Perry are, are slimming down unless Perry made it to the top three. You tried submarine in a car. Is that fixed? Uh, I haven't tried it. I don't know exactly how it works. Does it just drive a car into the water? So that's someone who's down. This guy's gonna be getting hit by the gas pretty soon. I, I think he's, he's a little too thirsty for this death, for this kill. He's not protecting his own life. I think the last guy might just win. Nikora. Okay, we don't. Okay, gangster from G1, I guess. All right, never mind. We, so we didn't even get to see Perry, unfortunately. Perry the platypus. But that was that was fun. It was fun, nonetheless. I was pretty well... I probably could have... I could have just gone for the second place there. Like, I was pretty well set up. I had a nice car. Would have been fine. But we would have missed out on Perry. We would have missed out on Perry. I think it was worth it. It was totally worth it. Okay, here, actually, here's a, here's a poll. I'm interested in, in your feedback, dear dear audience. Let's see, I'll add a poll. Perry trolling. Perry trolling W or L. W worth it. L focus up. Focus on the challenge. There we go. There is a poll. Perry trolling. Is that a W or an L chat? Do we, and if so, for example, basically, if we get the opportunity again, should we, should we mess around or should we focus? That's the question. Do we want to get that sweet, sweet content, these janky moments, or do we, we just want to get, get the bag. We want to get that tournament bag. I feel like we're already at three out of five. Like there's no risk. We're, we're going to get it eventually, right? We can take the. I feel like we can take the scenic route, right? Like there's no rush. We only need two more games. Each game takes like what, 15, 20 minutes, 20 minutes maximum. We might, we might only have 40 minutes left on this, on this tournament. So we can take, I feel like we can take the scenic route. All right. Well, uh, we'll close the poll. Cast your votes. You got five seconds. Four, three, two, one. End poll. All right, what's the results? 83% say worth it. All right, all right. I take that as encouragement. If we get opportunities to do something janky, we will do something janky. What happened to my voice, bro? Says Fabian. Uh, I don't know, Fabian. What do you think happened? Or like, what is your perception of my voice? I maybe have a, I got, I, I a f maybe six months ago, a year ago, I got a new microphone. Nearly a year ago. That's kind of the only difference, as far as I'm aware. New headset. I think the the headset wouldn't change my. I'm not using like a headset microphone. I'm using a. Pro Gamer Streamer Microphone, the Shure SM7B. Doing a countdown like YouTube doesn't have a seven second, that's a good point. I did a five second, 
I did a five second countdown and then ended the stream and pro and on your end the, the uh, didn't end stream I like ended the ended the poll the poll probably ended on your end before I you even heard the countdown probably to be fair I should have like lagged it in my head I should have deliberately I should have ended the poll late I suppose. You sounded German. Well, yeah, when I was speaking German. I think it's a widespread phenomenon that when people speak a foreign language, their tone of voice changes to match the language. Russia forever. Oh, is this, is this a patriot, patriotism, Russian patriotism lobby now? Should I type Slava Ukraine in the chat? No, I'm not. I'm not going to get involved. Any game? I'm just going to focus on the game, bro. That might be it. Oh, if, yeah, Fabian. If I think, I don't know what. I wonder. I feel like my voice maybe gets a little more jolly when I'm speaking German. Like I, I think the germ, my my German character is like. The German guys that buy the nuclear power plant in The Simpsons. He's like kind of jolly, chubby. There's like jo there's like this jolly, fat German guy. He's like really friendly and really nice. And he, they like, they buy the nuclear power plant in The Simpsons. One of the classic episodes. Ooh, loadout. Hidden cash is the OP, bro. Loadout off rip. Thank you very much. Blended. Speak Mandarin for us. Uh, what a Jongwon for the Uh That just means my, my I speak Chinese badly. Or it kind of sounds like it means my Chinese speaks badly. But that's how you gotta say it. What a Jongwon for the buhao. What a Koyin mama hoo hoo. Just like my accent is mediocre. Mama hoo hoo. Which literally means horse, horse, tiger, tiger. Mama is horse, horse. Hoo hoo is tiger, tiger. And together, that means mediocre. Whoa, someone. Hey, bro, you doing a, you doing an Intel contract by any chance? You getting that juicy Intel? All right, never mind. Uh, I don't want to actually put this... I realize that carrying this uh, suppression mine was just a pointless risk because that might do some damage. Like, it, it gets hit markers and stuff, so I don't really want to do it. Hit this buy station, get a self and a gas mask. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for my restock. There we go. Alright, nothing else really. Let's just loot up some more plates because I only have five. Ooh, that was... Oh crap! No thanks. No thank you. I can't get through that window. Of course not. That would make too much sense. It's not a good hiding spot, to be honest. Time to leave. Let me hit the drone and get out of here, bro. Peace out. See ya. Straight to the cargo. We should probably hover and wait for the next zone. We could let's go straight to this drone. And we'll use that to go to the center of the next zone. Ooh, I'm flying straight over my bounty hunter. Dude should have should have brought a sniper. It's solos, bro. What are you doing? Sniper meta is back. You you could have hit you could hit the shot of all shots. Get me out of the sky in one bullet. But instead, you're just peppering me up in the back. Okay, I'm gonna we're gonna hide upstairs near this uh, near the drone. Here footsteps, someone's nearby. 
We get in this dank corner. You got a loadout drop inbound. Wait for the zone to appear, and then we hit the drone, go to the middle of whatever zone that is. Or we could... I guess there's no reason to leave. I could just wait here. And we'll just farm up a bunch of bunch of smokes. Ideally, we can carry six of them. We'll just sit here. Both, all, all ingress points, doors, are in front of me. And I'm in a dark corner, pretty well hidden, so... I hope that, you know what, I actually kind of, kind of just want to get rid of this. Just, just, just in case someone finds it and uses it against me. If they, if they come real close, they might pick up the stun and use it. I don't know. You have a bit more of a jovial tone with a bit more heft when you speak German. That might just be how I speak to... That is me on Prox chat, though. Like, this is me talking... This is this is me talking normally, right? Like, on on stream, this is, this is me talking... This is how I talk to everyone ever, right? But when I'm on Prox chat, I'm kind of a bit more insincere and sing-songy and jokey so i'm like hi guys final zone time like anyone want to lift hey P I'm like, oh no perry perry where are you get get on the back let's go perry let's go like it's a bit it is my my actual personality over prox chat is a bit you don't want to be too sincere over prox chat because i think the only sincerity you normally hear over prox chat is like sincerely toxic people like people who are genuinely angry and upset or hate filled you want to you want to keep it light you want to keep it silly because prox chat if it's not silly it's generally pretty toxic you got to keep it silly but at least at least that's 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 what i do i keep it silly so i might have just sounded a bit sillier because i was talking on prox chat not because i was talking german i don't know Benjamin just got second with zero damage for the tournament. First game, camping is easy. Yeah, exactly, Benjamin. This this tournament seems a little, like, it's so much harder if you're trying to prepare for a zero kill win. Like, you got to fill, you got to waste, you got to dedicate resources to carrying, carrying stims instead of just, just keeping yourself alive until late-ish. All right, farmed up. I could carry some more plates. That's the one thing I could really benefit from. Let's see, where's the next zone gonna be? Where's the next zone gonna be? That's childish whimsy. You get a bit more guttural, but still sweet. Okay. Where's the circle? Come on, I'm impatient. Four, three, two, one. Next circle, please. Wow, that means a lot to me. Just staying in exactly the same spot. I might actually pop out to go to the bathroom. BRB, chat. Um, let me know if anyone comes in.
Right, chat. Did I miss anything? Anyone? Anyone come in? Anyone pop a UAV? Any, any, was there any peril at all? You should check the scores on the leaderboard. See how many people have max scores. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check it in in background here. Let's check the leaderboard. Um. <laughs> okay, look, look at this. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna old tab out. Look at this. Look, look at look at all these look at all these bots with negative scores, bro. Average score minus. These people are getting kills, bro. You don't know you're in a pacifist tournament. Let's see if we got any DMMBs here. Yeah, look at that. Oh, I'm 16th. That's probably because I only have what like three done. Where's the where's the can I see the top scorers? Of like the whole Okay, so the dragon. Dragon has a 120 average score. There's three people with the three top scorers. Oh, he had one death. So wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, wait, let's sort by score. Okay, yeah, look, okay, we got <laughs> placement third, 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 second, second. Yeah, we're gonna. <laughs> there's, there's, there's several people. There's several people that are just gonna have. They're gonna have perfect scores. So we need. We need to get two more games. We need two more games. <laughs> oh. And then I think the leaderboard is essentially just going to show the order in which people signed up for the tournament. So I might not even come top three or something because I don't know if I was even the, one of the top first three to sign up. Gas is inbound, marking a new safe zone. Ooh, ooh. Uh, okay, I guess we've got to go to these houses somewhere. This gas station with the LTVs is looking mighty tempting. I might hit the drone here, fly over to the, fly over to the gas station, because these LTVs they're parked. Well, actually, that's not marked as a gas station on the map, so I don't know if those will be full health or not. It, this building, I think, looks like a gas station. I'll go scope it out. I think hanging out near these LTVs might be a good idea because if it goes to the open circle, hanging out in LTV would be be the way to do it. Can I parkour up to the roof? Yeah, I probably I feel like I should be able to, but I can't. Uh, I got room for one more plate. Did someone just zip? I just heard a zip line, bro. Right, never mind. Upsie daisy. Let's go scope out the LTV room. Otherwise, we'll just hang out in some random, some random room. Ooh, what if? What if? Whoa! No. Okay. I think on Warzone Two, like our Ma our Mazra, the top of those like towers was was actually solid, and you could just kind of sit on top of that. I saw Pete doing it in his ranked ranked gameplay. Maybe we, let's try get up. Let's try get up there again. Like that. Yeah, boy. Look at this. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice spot. I might actually stay here. What? What? Okay. Okay. It's it, maybe it's not as stable as I hoped it would be. Let's go back up there. I think I need to make sure I actually stay on top of these little str struts, or I'll fall through. What? Like, like it, nah, This is, this is a, uh, this is not stable enough. I, I, don't, I just don't feel confident on the, on that. Let's scope out. Look, this, this totally looks like a gas station, but there's, there's people. It's not marked as a gas station, so I don't know if it would actually work as one and keep the. There we go. As long as I stay on this tip, I think I won't fall through because there's enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the skies. What the hell? Yeah, we'll be probably be fine up here. So, so what I'm confused about is that building very much looks like a gas station, and 
I don't know whether those cars are actually full health because they're parked at a gas station. But it's not marked as a gas station on the map, so I suspect it wouldn't even work. Maybe I should just go to this big, big ass car dealership in the middle. Can I? I wonder, can I fly in? Is there an upstairs with those windows? Could I fly through the window there? Plenty. This is a very dank, dank building. I think there's plenty of, plenty of dank spots for me to hide in. Like over here. Nice. Very dank. Gas is closing in. I want to be upstairs though. I feel like there's an upstairs that should be accessible, but maybe it's just a double height. No, here we go. Here's like a mezzanine type thing, and there's a there's roof access, which I. Don't really need a lot of sm lot of smoke grenades lying around as well. That's nice. There we go. Nice sequestered in this dank upstairs office building. For sure, you are farming this tournament more than anyone else, though. Even if you don't win, it was made for me, Dominican. Yeah, I don't. Actually, that I wonder. What if we if we did a custom lobby, where the win, like the a prize is awarded to whoever comes second place with zero kills. Well, the what would happen is everyone would survive until the end, go in the gas. The gas would lag out, and then it would be random. It would just be random. Who there would be like some massive gas tick, and everyone would get wiped out in the same instant. And it would be random. Like whether you come first is random, and when you come, when you come second is random. That's probably what would happen if we did a custom lobby of this. Night Sand says it's a broken gas station. So Night Sand, do you, do you know if it actually works and heals the cars, or is it just it's just it's just a building? It looks like a gas station. Does it work as a gas station? Is my question. It's still an LTV. I actually suspect, given where this circle is, I bet the next circle, well, it could still, it could pull aggressively over here. But I'm pretty, I'm close enough that if it pulls, there's like a 50-50 chance, I think, that I'm actually in the next circle. Which is kind of as good as it gets. I think. Yes, it's moving. It's like, oh, someone's to my right. I guess in this building, one this, one of these two to my right, I can hear him stumbling around in there. <laughs> it doesn't work because it doesn't show a gas station, right? Right, Haim? That's that's kind of what I thought. That might also be why two there were two LTVs there. You're in the top ten. Ooh. Keep knocking them out. I bet everyone has heartbeat sensors. They're gonna find me. 10 people left. I need to just... I need to stay alive. I need 7 more people to die. Problem is, there's a lot of buildings here. There's like... There's gonna be like, you know... There's some guy to my right who's probably alone. He's gonna be safe. Ooh. He's moving. Oof. Ooh. Look at that. Look at that pull. Look at, look at this little sliver. Look at this little crevice I can just exist in. I'm gonna stay there, man. Perfect. And if I need to, if this wall's too thick, I can go get roof access and go and stand on the ledge if I need to. Probably. I'm going to stay here. You're losing ground. Move it. Hello out there. Can anyone hear me on Prox chat? Don't worry everyone. I I'm going for a zero kill loss today. I'm no threat to anyone. I, I just want to wait until it I'm in a top three situation and then I'll just let myself die. If that's okay with you guys. I don't want to come first. I just want to come second or third. I don't want to kill anyone. Gas is 
closing in. Relocating the safe zone. Ooh, look at that pull. Like, what a, what a perfect pull for me, man. I actually think this is so bad for everyone else except me. The only one guy is going to be around when this when this circle finishes finishes shifting. Your squad's in the top five. Top five. Hello, hello, top four situation. Watch out, guys, there's an airstrike. Oh, we didn't get anyone yet. Still four of us alive, everyone. Still four people, dude. And how are there so many people still alive? We're all survivors together, everyone. Oh, there's a, there's some fighting. There's some fighting, everyone. How? Kill him! Kill him! Get get him out of the match, bro. Kill him. You haven't killed him yet, bro. You haven't killed him. There's still four people. There we go. There we go. It's a top three situation. Now, now I can just uh, make myself known. Hello. Hello, hello, hello down there. Hello. I'm in the smoke, everyone. I'm in the smoke. I'm out on the street. I'm in the smoke, everyone. I'm in the smoke. I'm in the smoke, everyone. Well, that, that trophy system really did a great job. Good job, Mr. Mind. How did that guy throw a Semtex when I, I put I put down the trophy? There we go. Perfect score. Third place. Third place. Zero kills, zero damage. Let's spectate this out. Let's see what happens. Oh, what? Oh, he's above. Oh, for a second, I thought someone must be doing a gas play or something. Oh, not Mr. Mind. Mere Mind. He's got 10 kills. Ooh, the right shielder. Oh no, it's a revive off. What's gonna happen, dude? I think I, I think the right shield's gonna win. Because he can't melee through the right shield. Yeah, there we go. That's it. That was the that was the symmetry breaker. As soon as like they, if they both try to melee each other, the right shield is gonna be protected. I mean sometimes it works, sometimes not. <laughs> GG's. Thanks for third place. Perfect for me. I was the weirdo spamming smoke at the end. <laughs> Should have taken second. Might come. It doesn't make a difference, Andrew. It doesn't. It's, it's the same score. It's 120 points uh, for third place. Third place or, or second place. It doesn't make a difference. All right. All right. Let's uh. Let's just let's just hit the let's just hit the play again button. See if that'll work. All right, we're one game away from our. Wait, what? It didn't. It didn't update. What the heck? There we go. Transform center horizontally. There we go. Splendid. What if people have the same score? Um, I don't know, Haim. Uh, Dominican says that it comes down to who joined the tournament earlier. Which I think is kind of the opposite of the way it should be. The earlier you join the tournament, the more time you have to rack up points. So it should be like if if you had the same point, like if you spent all day getting a perfect score and then someone comes in in the last two hours and also gets a perfect score. I feel like that guy who only spent two hours did it better because they did it faster. So I feel like it should be in reverse order of who joined the tournament. But then again, that from that from repeat re, repeat gg's perspective they probably they want to incentivize they want to reward people for for joining the tournaments in the first place like they don't want people to to wait because if you wait you might not participate at all 
So the way I think they're they, they're breaking it down is you get the you get a tie break in your favor if you join the tournament earlier. No, she, secret dance move. The number of second place wins versus third place wins, I don't think matters because they give you the same points. Um, and only your top five games count. So you only need five of them. Why is the purpose to not win? Okay, I'm going to, I'll do it for anyone who's joined the stream recently. I will, uh, I will go over it again. I'll, I'll do another explanation. So today, what we are doing on repeat.gg we are playing in the Sunday Fun Day Passivism Battle Royale Solos tournament. So it's a passivism tournament. And the way they try to incentivize that with the scoring structure is that kills award kills punish you minus 20 points per kill. So you don't want you want as few kills as possible. You also want you also get punished for damage, minus 0 0.07 points, right? Um and the so the only way you can get gain points is with placement. But un unusually, the first place awards zero points. Um, the most points you can get is for second or third place, you get 120 points. Uh, fourth or fifth gi gives you 80. Six, seven, eight Enemy gives you 60 coming. points. Let me mute this. Um, so this is sort of an anomalous, confusing thing that, that first place gives you fewer, gives you no points gives you fewer points than second place. And my only theory for this is that if first place gave you 120 points, there'd be a bunch of people getting 100 points. There'd be loads and loads of people that just got a one kill win. What the heck? I want to mute my, mute my computer. There we go. There'd be a bunch of people who get down to the 1v1 and then think, okay, I need to kill the last guy, even though... It cost me minus 20 points, I'll get 120 for the win. So they'll still kill the last person. Um, so most people, I, I think that whoever came up with this scoring structure didn't really think about zero kill wins, to be honest. Why is my, my game is just mute, muting and unmuting it's muting and unmuting itself willy nilly. Very strange. Right, here we go. Back in the game. Battle Royale. Am I going to play on Vondel later? Um, yeah, probably not. Let's, let's stretch over to Levine Resort. This seems to be working pretty well for me so far. Enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the sky. What if people have the same score? It's a good question, Haim. We'll find out. Yeah, so there's a f the five the five thousand dollar prize pool, uh, which I talked about in my last video. Uh, that is resurgence only. Any resurgence mode, as far as I know. And that one heavily rewards kills and damage. Uh, so that's why I was handicapping myself by doing zero kills, but trying to get as much damage as possible, because I can at least get points for the damage. Anyone coming in? Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Nope. Jam Cow says, I'm joined but not qualified. So basically that means that... So if you join... It'll start tracking all your games. Um, but basically, you need to play the minute, the same, you need to play enough games to actually score. So, like, if they, this tournament that I'm doing right now, it, it only counts your five best games. Um, so, you need to play at least five games to qualify. If you don't play at least five games, you don't qualify. So, that, so you probably haven't, you haven't played five games yet. And I think the the tracking only updates once per hour, so it might it might you might you might need to wait a second for it to you might need to wait a few minutes or an up to an hour for the website to update with however many uh, games you have played. But you need to play at least five, even if they're terrible games. You get you, if you get five if you play five games and you get some points, 
or even neg negative points, then you'll show up in the leaderboard. But until you've played five games, you just don't show up at all. So that's probably why you haven't qualified Dominican. That would be my guess. <clears throat> Uh, I hear a crate, but I don't know where it is. Jam cow's day off. Yeah, zero kill losses. I'm taking it easy, bro. Another self res. Don't really need it, dude. I hear a. Oh. Can I get over? There we go. Ooh, okay, we got some orange boxes. So, one in the bands. There's one up here on top, and one in this little, little chunky little cafe next to the L of Levine. So, upstairs on the green ping, there's this one here. Up we go. Bro. This is weird. There we go. Ooh, UAV, thank you. Then we'll go over to the, the other green ping. Just getting as much money as possible that I can buy a loadout and everything will be fine. Everything will be hunky dory. Is it? Guess I gotta go downstairs. Oh, there we go. Um, I guess we got to go get the free the free load out because it's going to get eaten real quick. We could just spend our money on other stuff. Lovely jubbly. Okay. Let me get rid of this self revive. Don't really need the extra one. What the heck does this mean? Like, press P to have. Down here it says press P to have. Like, just jam cow muni box has. Jam. Okay, this is weird, dude. Uh, what, what should I buy? Plate box, another muni. Anything else to buy? Not really. Here another plate box. Whatever. Um, oh, loadout is kind of weirdly inaccessible. Just gonna have to faff around to get 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 on the roof here or something. There we go. All right, there we go. Splendid. I think we're set up. Everything is organized. We've got everything we could possibly want. And we're going to head in the zone. I'm going to catch a ride on this drone over here. Head in the zone. Keep going. Over to pop off power. We'll find a crane to sit on, I suppose. Dominicans loading into your first you're loading into your first BR solo forever or you just you haven't played BR solos in ages. Get ready for loads of cheese. I feel like there's oh yep, there he is. I saw I saw some traces. I saw some shots being fired. I don't know. I feel like if I go up here the sniper might focus me.
Is he looking at me? That's the question. Hello there. Hello there, crane, cr my crane brother. Okay, lovely, lovely, jubbly. I'm just gonna make him forget I exist. I think there should be like a pretty dank spot in this tower. Oh, there's a mosquito in the area. That's not good. Gas is closing in. Relocating the safe zone. All right. Could be worse. Uh, all right. So this snipey boy in the in the crane probably isn't going to leave anytime soon. I would like to be in the other crane. A crane is a nice place to be, but I don't really want that dude to know I'm here. Hmm. What the crap? There's no way someone's up up top, right? Okay, I think he's gonna he's gonna focus on that those shots, that fight. I'm just going to go up here, dee dee dee, and get back up top. Alright. Is he still there? Oh, he jumped. Looks like, uh, I think he killed someone on the roof here. There's two of them. Wait. Oh no, that's just, uh, that's just like random birds or something. Can't see anything with the glare, bro. There's like a tiny little man running around there on the roof. Hello. Hello, snipey boy. And that was a bad miss. That was a very bad miss, bro. That was ter- Bro. Bro, maybe you should change your loadout or something because that was terrible. What the heck is going on, bro? I'm just gonna, just gonna nestle here, man. I can't see anything through the glare. It's it's all, it's all terrible. Maybe he's not even looking at me. Maybe he it looked like he shot someone to the left of me. But I don't know where they could be. He's still shoot. I think he's he actually wasn't looking at me. That sniper who was glinting at me wasn't actually looking at me. He was glinting at someone to my low left, wherever that might be. Maybe on the road? Maybe on this bridge? Maybe? Could have been someone there. I don't know. Whoa! Okay, okay. What the? That's another crane. Hello! I, I, can't, I cannot see this guy at all. I, I think I see like three pixels that might be the, might be a person. But, um, I, I assume he can see me. Is that him? I can't even ping through this window. There he is. 248 meters. <sighs> well, he's going to waste his ammo for no reason. Who's shooting? Is it still the same guy? Oh, dang. Okay. we go. I don't know exactly how wall bangable the little control cabs of the cranes are. Gas is inbound. Like, I, if this, I don't know if, would this roof protect me? I'm not sure. Okay. We could stay in the circle. We can actually just clamber along this crane and we'll still be in the circle. And I think maybe this other, the same is true of this other crane. See, the, uh, that, that end of the crane is still in. This guy will still be in. He's not focusing on me. He's shooting someone on the roof. So we can stay here. At least until the circle closes and we see the next circle. And then we can... Ooh, someone's zipping up. There's going to be a fight, maybe. 
We jumped off. What is this guy doing? He's doing aerobatics. Jailbreak is not good for this challenge because it just just gives more. Just I, I want there to be fewer people left, right? I, I'm 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 impatient for the top three situation. How many people came back? I mean, he is solo. Oh, 41. We went up. We went from 29 to 41. So we got 12 extra people. Now we'll see how many of them were AFK with parachute turned off. Look, they all died. So went went down from uh, 41 to 34. So we went 29 plus 12 minus 7 to full damage immediately. I think you should use your gun if it's a 1v1, says Big Berto TV. Using using guns is what everyone else does, though, Big Berto. What what would be the point in that? It would lose. It would also cost me points in the tournament. This tournament punishes kills. If you scroll way back to the beginning of the stream, I explain the scoring of this tournament I'm in. Kills are punished with minus twenty points each. So I definitely don't want to kill the last guy in a one v one. And if it's if it's a one v one, um, second place would get me one hundred twenty points, and first place gets me nothing. So I don't not only. So if I kill the last guy in a 1v1, I go from plus 120 points to minus 20 points. It's the last thing I want to do. Or plus some damage as well, actually. I'd, get, I'd lose some points for damage. If I did 300 damage, then I'd lose an additional 21 points just from the damage of killing the guy. Big Berto. So it will be... That's a terrible idea, Big Berto TV. You've got to play the game... You've got to play the game as... As defined by the rules, as you got to play to the scoring structure. I don't think there's anyone left on that crane, so if I just hop up here, I might be okay. Can I go up, please? All right, all right, okay. Bunch of guys fighting for their lives down at the gas line. They're not going to worry about me. I think you can actually snipe through these. This grating is, you can shoot through it, but this floor, you probably can't. All right, what are we doing? Ugh. Maybe this this big building has the best chance of being in this circle and the next. So we've got to just fly across. Try not to get sniped out of the air. We. I'm, gonna actually, I'm not going to make it by air, so I'm going to have to land on a car. Bye, 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 bye. There's bound to be someone in here, right? Bro. That draw charge gave me so much, spla way more splash damage out than I was expecting. Can I just pick up this armor, please? Thank you. Ideally, someone would come slamming through this door here. I'll just do it myself. There we go. Slap bang in the middle. Right, there we go. Fine. Perfect. Perfect. Perfect positioning. Perfect resources. Everything's good. Try car water seat swap. Uh, is that like the submarine glitch thing with the cars? I don't want to abuse a glitch. Certainly not to win a tournament for money. Winner gets twenty dollars. Yeah, first place is twenty dollars. Um, I don't know what the th second, third places get, but Ten there's remaining. multiple people with a perfect score at the top. So I just need to make sure I get a perfect score, and then we'll see where I find where I where it shakes out with me in the uh, in in the leaderboard. Gas is Oof, in. Okay, I might stay located. in this corner. Like I'll stay in this building and just shift corners. Occupation scan, dude. Alright, 
out what's going on. Enemies detected. Locations marked. Gas is moving. This guy hasn't seen me, but he's going to be hanging out. He's going to take the corner I want to take. Two guys in this house is not good. Fight each other, bro. Push each other. There's two guys in this house. They can fight each other. There we go. Groot skin. Stack yo. Hello. Hey. Hello. Are you, are you a tree skin? Are you a Groot? Ooh, cluster mine. Watch out. No, stack yo. Did you kill the. Or, is that you? Did you kill the tree guy in the building? Bro, cluster mines, dude. There's nothing you can do about it, man. Bro, I I heard that cluster mine. I just thought it was way further back. Like it just, damn, bro. Like I literally, I was, I wanted to go out of the door that was right next to me, but I thought there was a cluster mine right there. So I went around this way, and the cluster mine just still splash damaged me, bro. That's, I mean, I still get some points for fifth place. Man. Okay, my no, none of the buttons working. There we go. Are self revive pistols active? No, they've been taken out of the game. Taken out, Andrew. They've been taken out. Ah, uh, well, okay. Let's uh, let's take another look at the leaderboard. Let's refresh the page. We'll see where we're, where we're, where we're at because we got. We should be probably kind of high. Okay, look. Okay, let's just clear this off. Let's take a look. Right. Looking at the top of the leaderboard, we have three people at the top with a perfect score, right? 120. And we're trying, if I can get another second or third place with zero kill, if I managed to get third place there, I would be joining them in the top three or the top four. I am currently down here at 13 with a 106.5 uh average score so if we sort by our top score what the why is what why is it counting me as having all this damage dude what the hell what where's all this all this damage coming from dude So like these are the four the four games I got, you know, second or third place. Where but why I don't know why it's counting all this like two damage, twenty-two damage, thirty-eight, forty-one. I don't know where that damage is coming from, but as a result, it's kind of trimming off some of my score. I don't know what's going on, dude. It must be the smokes, right? The smokes, like, like on the back end, like, are the smokes counting some, as some kind of damage? Maybe? I, it, I don't understand. I guess everyone else mu must just, the people who are actually in the top three with, a, with pure 120, they must not be, maybe they're not using smokes. They're not using anything. Like they're not using any equipment at all. Me using smokes might be like some other system might be counting the smokes as doing some damage to people. I don't know. I, 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 I definitely have made sure I haven't hit a single person with a smoke. I haven't bounced a smoke off them and got a hit marker with a smoke. That's the thing. I haven't hit anyone direct impacted. Well, what just happened, bro? I was about to, I was about to, like, I was about to hear Graves' rigmarole, and the game's kind of just bugged on me, dude. What's going on? It does seem harsh, Neil.
It's confusing is what it is. I'm not really sure where it's coming from. Maybe I can figure it out by looking at my gameplay. Whole game's just uh, crashed, bro. What's going on? Is there an update? Okay, I, I'm. I guess I'm just gonna force quit the game, and we'll re relaunch. Don't know what's happening. Game's just bugged on me. What about damage to yourself when you use the Molotov? Yeah, mate. Well. I don't think I've actually, I haven't actually died to myself. I have never actually done damage to myself. I wonder if it's Gulag? What, one, one difference might be like, maybe I'm, I might be the only one who's actually getting out of the Gulag with zero kills, maybe. So everyone else is, they're, they're, there's zero kill sec. Can I close? I'm just going to alt F4 this game, bro. Game's crashing. Task manager. End process. End task. You die. There we go. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. Relaunching the game as soon as I get the option. Fall damage, maybe Jared, but it's, it seems seems it seems strange that. So if we go back to like the desktop here, it seems strange that. Oh look, okay, okay, okay. Wait, so Dragon has average score of one twenty, but in some of his. Their games, wait, no, okay, that's not in his best games. So, in his best games, he managed to get zero. And same here. If you sort by the score to get the best games, dying once, yeah, so this part, this part, this play tube managed to go to the gulag, or maybe had a redeploy token, came back, but your his dying did not affect the damage. It wasn't like self damage or anything like that weird oh i've got a i've got a rejoin match option i don't know if that's gonna that might bug out the game i don't even know i got 442 damage on a game with no damage displayed i think it was because it, yeah i wonder if it's like i wonder if it i wonder if it's like um damage to equipment and stuff like that like like if you crash into a car or something okay I, I rejoined the game as a dead guy i think i can hear it even though the game hasn't loaded i'm just gonna leave mash bro okay i can hear that i am currently dead spectating someone else so that's unfortunate hey low tier god ksi ksy Thank you for the, thank you for the love. Yeah, Neil, I think it could be vehicle damage or maybe equipment damage. Like if I, um, like if I, if I, if I blew up someone else's claymore, something like that, or crashed into a car, maybe even driving a vehicle and then crashing the vehicle, that might contribute. Like, maybe I'm doing damage to the car by driving. Really strange. Very strange. Damage to empty vehicles shouldn't count. Now this should damage to yourself. I agree. I don't think it would count. What we could try, we could. I guess we could. We could test it. What I could do is just start the match by like 
you know, shooting up a car. Like, I'll just pick a car and just randomly, randomly spray it down. Do loads of damage to a vehicle. And then at the end, go, you know, play out the match. And then we can see on the leaderboard what happens with the, all that damage. See if it affects anything. Playtime's over. Stand by for deployment to the war zone. Wonder if healing a vehicle would get negative damage. Maybe I could <laughs> exploit the, the gas station. We got the green light. You're going to the war zone. Grab your gear and shoot. We're up in three. Enemy activity will be high. Maybe maybe I can get maybe I could get negative damage by healing a car. But I did that in the well actually I did that in the game with um I did do that in the game with Perry. I healed the vehicle. But I have no games on record with negative damage or positive damage. I actually have not a single game with zero damage. So something is something I'm consistently doing every game is counting as damage. Weird. Very strange. Any ideas? Could it be the trophy systems? I've only thrown a trophy system once. And it didn't really do anything. Oh no, I threw it twice actually. And it neither one actually did anything. And it and uh, I actually think it is possible that a trophy system can get normal damage that shows up in game. So like for example, if I had a trophy system on my car or something, it, like if, if I had a trophy system, right, and an enemy throws a Semtex or throws a knife or anything near, they're standing next to the trophy system and they throw something, the trophy system obviously like blows up, destroys whatever they throw. And that little destruction explosion, if, the, if it's close to the person, they can actually take some splash damage from the trophy destroying their throwable. And, but that will actually show up as damage. Like, you get, like, a hit marker for it or something. Like, and, and it would show up here in my, uh, in my damage done in the game. I think it's damage done by your car. Maybe, like, <laughs> maybe it's, like, damage... The heck? Did I get kicked for inactivity or something? Because I didn't land fast. What, what, my game, my game's just bugging out massively now. Maybe I need to like restart. My game's actually just like broken right now. I don't know what's happening, bro. Do assists from smoke count damage? I don't think so, Pure Blood. I, I, I've never seen an assist pop up just because I threw a smoke. I don't think that's happened. Okay, game's bugged out. I think what I need to do is maybe do a relaunch. And then cl I'll try to... I'm going to end task. I'm going to relaunch it. Then I'm going to close it properly. Or maybe I should check for update. The game is updating, says Solomore. Okay. Or we'll wait for the... Uh, I'm going to check for updates. It says up to date. Okay, I'm going to play. What I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to launch the game close the game out like safely then i'm going to launch the game again maybe when you put down your trophy earlier and the guy threw a semtex you damaged yeah it, I, that it could be i think that would show up on my scoreboard though cuz i've seen that showing up on my scoreboard before um or i've seen it showing up on someone's scoreboard before um, okay, no, I do not want to rejoin. Yes, quit match. Quit match. Quit match. Yes, quit match. Quit match. Yes, quit match. What? This is... This is a... This is a janky loop, dude. If you talk bad about Activision, they instantly kick you. I hope not. Server crash worldwide? Is that true, Noxbet? Is there a... Should I ch should I check COD updates Twitter or something? Is there a server crash worldwide? All right, game game's got me through. I'm gonna check check the. All I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna clean 
quit the game. There's no, there's nothing on COD updates Twitter, so I don't know. I don't know if there's any actual problem. I'm just gonna relaunch the game again. Could it be ricochet bullets off shield? Hmm. Hmm. That's a good. I actually, that's a good point. Gaming gonna. I you do get, you do get x when 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 someone is shooting my shield. And then they die. You get you do get a pop up that says like, crowd control, right? Like if if someone dies, while shooting your shield you get like a like the game attributes something to you like you've contributed to their demise somehow like you distracted them you suppressed them you're a nuisance or something um it might be that it might be people shooting at the shield and then like dying maybe Maybe that maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Oh, Neil, you DM'd me Spencer's Twitter Twitch thing. <laughs> nice, thanks, Neil. Matchmaking's taking a while. I wonder if there is like an outage. Maybe if they've put it up quick enough. All I know is me and my whole friends list crashed at the same time. Oh, okay, Noxvet. Can any anyone else in is anyone else playing right now and can confirm whether or not there's like an outage? Like if there's there's anything consist other people crashing? I don't see that. I don't see anyone else tweeting about it. I seem to be getting in a lobby. Yeah, Knoxville. I'm not saying uh, the the crowd control is not is not bullets bouncing off and like doing damage to other people. The crowd control is just like the bullets get deleted, like get eaten by your shield and deleted, right? Um, and the person that was shooting your shield, then maybe you get some kind of kill credit for them dying to someone shooting them in the back while they're distracted shooting you. That's the only, that's the, that's my only, only idea. That might be what's happening. So far, so good. Game seems to be working, but I guess if it kicks me again, I might just have to give up. Call of Duty down detector just shot up in reports. Oh, okay. Let me, let me check. Down detector. Call of Duty. Yeah. Yeah, look down here. Like a uh, massive spike. Um, just, you know, in the last 15, 20 minutes or something. I have a problem with Call of Duty server connect. I guess, I guess strictly speaking, for me, it's I, it's staying in the game. I'll just say server connection. It's, it just sounds like, uh, it just it kind of seems like my game's crashing and I can't stay in a match. But I don't know. Maybe it was just a temporary outage. Maybe someone unplugged the server and now they plugged it back in. I'm in a lobby now. Ninety nine people. Seems to be fine. Well, okay, don't want to jinx it. Last lobby also seemed fine, and then I froze. All stations, this is Shadow zero one. Your scoreboard says zero damage at zero. That's I would agree, Noxvet. That's that's what I thought as well. Let's get that bird spinning. Finish up. We're airborne at three. That's what I thought as well. We got the green light. We're going to the war zone. Grab your gear and shoot. We're up in three. Rules of engagement are simple. Weapons free on all threats. <sighs> Activision needs to move their COD servers from Amazon ones to 
Google ones. I think if they move them at all, it will be to Azure, Microsoft Azure, like servers. I don't know if that will be an improvement or not, but that that might that might happen. That might if they decide to vertically integrate with, with Microsoft. That's actually really not good that this guy is. Oh. I might just go to this little hidden cache building. For the money. Ooh, lovely jubbly. Free self res. Buy station marker? I'll take it. It's a white crate. Normal gas mask. Only $4,000 is not that much, though. Not very impressed. Is there another crate anywhere? I hear something. Maybe on the roof. Or in the next building. Well, that, that's actually kind of underwhelming. Usually you get a lot more money from hidden caches than that. But never mind. I'll make sure I'm recording this gameplay in case any anything interesting happens. I think I heard someone to my right. Oh, a loadout, lovely. You got a loadout drop inbound. I think there might be someone close by who might hear my loadout though. That's a problem. Oh! Exactly what I'm talking about. Time to leave. Can't get in that way. Twenty tick servers now, yeah. It's always, they've always been a little on the janky side. Is this guy chasing me? I feel like I kind of hear stuff, but not really. I don't know, bro. Possible to know in the first game you won, you threw a smoke at someone and it gave you XP. Are you sure? I don't remember that. Can you remember what kind of XP I got, Crowcutter? I don't remember getting smoke. I think what might have happened is I threw smoke and they were shoot they were shooting my shield, and I got XP for sh like if if someone sh the more someone shoots your shield, the more XP you get. You just get you just get XP. If someone shoots you in the shield. Like if someone if someone is like aiming at you with them if someone just mag dumps me with an LMG shooting into my shield, I will just get a load of XP from that. Every time someone shoots my 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 shield, I just get XP. And that does that does happen. So I th think that might be what, what happened. Let's just get the heck into the into the zone. Ooh, what if I could just chill out on here? On the roof here. That would be cool. Never mind. Maybe I should take the car, man. The car seems to be the way to do it. I get an LTV or something. Just calling a buy station here. 
Buy myself a Muni. Do like two Munis, one armor box. Oh, I already got Muni. Okay, great. Here we go. Um, got pretty stacked. I guess I'll just grab the car and leave. Uh, and I'll just head into the zone somewhere. This probably I could pick up this LTV. It might be better. But given an urban setting for the final circle, LTV might not be. Like a car might not be necessary or even useful. I don't know. I think an LTV is definitely the best, better choice. I, mean, I don't really care about speed, I care about fortification and health. I just gotta get central somewhere. I'm gonna go park up. Maybe, maybe I'll try to refuel the car and then I'll camp near the car. Whoa, okay. Great, great, yep. Good shots, bro. Good job. Yeah, I mean, Valorant has like 120 hertz tick, like tick, tick rate servers, doesn't it? Uh, Hyun? Like, it's not... 20 tick rate is really trash. Compared with the state of the art. Money, 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 money. Money, money, money. Alright, there we go. We could just sit here. Pretty central. Car's gonna be nice and healthy. We if this one gets stolen, we do have a backup car here. Um and we probably won't even need a car because it's an urban finish anyway. Jam with a late night stream. Uh, I kind of started late. That's why it's continuing late. That's the only reason. And I, and we're one game away from from finishing up and doing as best we can. This is why sometimes when you hit someone in the head, the shot is not registered, and you end up missing. Yeah, yeah, the low tick rate, totally. All right. I just want to lock in my fifth game at like as high as I can get it. I, oh, you know what we should do? I guess we should just like. I'm just going to do a buttload of damage to a car. Like, what if. Like, like, just, 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 just crank up loads of vehicle damage and see if that makes a difference, right? There we go. So I just did a bunch of damage to cars, which I think that won't count as far as the game is concerned. Like, as far as my actual, where's my knife? There we go. So it still counts zero damage done, right? But we can see um, when my fifth game, my fifth and final, when my most recent game gets added to the leaderboard, does it crank up loads and loads of damage just for vehicle damage? I fully destroyed two vehicles just then, so. That's pretty decent. Just as an experiment. They're going to steal your LTV. Well, if they do, it's not the end of the world because it's an urban finish. I probably don't actually need the car. The car might be a liability in this circle. If the so if it pull if it was like way out here in the countryside, then I'd want a car. Like up here, the north, right, right here. This was a that was a you know perfect circle to have a car. If I sell in, dude, I don't care. I've got everything I need.
It would be nice to get a couple more plates. I hear footsteps though. Oh, Semtex. Does someone know I'm here? Don't mind me, bro. If this guy Semtex is me, I'm going to throw the trophy and see if it can save me. There's a UAV. This guy might have a UAV on me and be searching for the red dot. I think he's... He's looking around for this red dot, bro. His UAV is expired. I think that guy was chasing a red dot on his UAV. Like, what might have happened is he popped a UAV earlier that showed I was here and pinged it and came back to it later and he's look and he popped UAV when I because he couldn't find me oh don't mind me 21 savage I think that guy might have seen me I don't know oh I, I, I thought that 21 savage had seen me oh don't mind me bro was that a loadout drop mark on the ground there no it's a perk package okay Okay. Can this guy leave? Oh, crap. Bro. Bye-bye. You're blind. See you later. All right, this circle actually, I might benefit from uh, from having a, um, a a car because it's it's kind of open. So I might, I'm gonna keep it with me. I'm gonna check out this buy station. I'm kind of low on plates. Can I see my? Yeah, I don't have a big stack yet. Big stack like anymore. Right, let's go. Hey, bro, you camping the buy station? You up on the ridge? I see you camping the buy station. Campy wampy. All right. Uh, what's going on here? We'll just okay whatever this is fine I guess I'll just sit here um, farming up my smokes it's not the best hiding spot might be better off if I can find an upstairs section maybe I don't know is there a staircase to get up here alright Dr. Disrespect Enemies was right. These are Chuck. It's like a guys. Chuck E. Cheese house. Just see her in the corner, bro. Why not? Cool. I think the guy who just arrived has, uh,. Gone up. He's found a way upstairs somehow. It sounds like he's above me. No UAV, but he could have a heartbeat sensor. He might be trying to find me. He might have even heard me moving around. I don't know. He's crouch walking. What, is it? what was that? Explosion? Problem is, someone might try to steal my LTV here. I should probably just take the LTV and go out in the countryside. Go to the edge and wait. Yeah, I'm going to just take the LTV and go to the edge and wait. Oh, crap. 
I'm going to go straight down south to the open open land where no one's going to live. The open, no, the complete no man's land. Hopefully be nice and uh, nice and alone down here. And we can just gradually creep in with the with the gas. I'm just going to going to follow the border, hug the border a little bit. Just double check there's no one hiding out here in the bush. Because someone else might have had the same idea as me. Just with no vehicle. Oh, th there's... Hey there. Hey, hey, Ridge guy. Are you up there? Can you hear me, Ridge guy? Hello. I'm just going to leave that guy alone. Uh, but if there's a guy right here... I guess I just want to... I want to stay in this, you know... Bottom left quarter of the zone. What this crane even? This, nah, this, there's no, there's no part of this crane that's in the next circle. There's no point going up here. Could land on top of this pylon, I guess. But oh, snipe! That guy on the ridge is trying to snipe me. Is that the same guy? Is that the same ridge guy? Has he moved all the way over there? He might have. He might have. Oh no, someone else is... Someone else is coming this way. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna leave these guys alone. I'm hoping that this part of the zone is a bit more friendly. Or less unfriendly, at least. 21 cabbage. I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna start saying that. When that 21 Savage got killed, he, he proved that he wasn't actually Savage. He was just a Cabbage. He was a 21 Cabbage, bro. Alright. Uh, Circle's pushing me up to the ridge here. But I am I am, I am pretty pleased with my choice of ve like My choice to have a vehicle, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? I don't know if this guy can snipe me out in this position. Yes, it's moving. Reverse, dude. Reverse. So weak driving backwards uphill. Whoa, these guys are straight up. Okay, there's, there's definitely two snipey boys that are focusing on me at the ridge. Oh, damn, bro. I should trophy this car, bro. Dang. This is awful. I got XP for him shooting my shooting my shield. I've got no plates. I'm a dead man. Guy's sniping me. I just need I just need a couple more people to die, bro. Okay, it's a top five. I just need two more to die, bro. There's a guy behind me who might come over this wall, and he probably saw me go to the to his left. He probably knows where I am. The guy behind me at the house with the sniper. He's still sniping, but he so he might be distracted by someone else. He's coming to my he's, he's coming to my side, bro. He's coming over the wall. Don't mind me. Yep, okay. One more death. I need to be a top three. That's it. One one person die. Hey guys, top four. I just want to be third place. That's okay. Mortar strike. Oh no. Gas is moving in. New safe zone located. That's awful. Can someone uh 
someone please kill someone? Please? That would be lovely. Someone die already, bro. Please. Pretty please. With a cherry on top. Okay, there. There we go. Top three. Thank you. Thank you, Pepe. Thank you. Thanks for killing me, bro. That, 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 that lobby felt kind of tough. Like, who knew that zero kill losses would put you in such sweaty lobbies, bro? <laughs> so, oh, I actually came second. I actually came second. So that that was uh, that's four seconds and one third. Play gas breakpoint. I don't. I didn't really want to break. Like, I didn't need to do anything too fancy. But the the ma the massive backpack full of smokes came in massively clutch there. Spamming smokes in the end in that when I lost my car. Alright. Properties. Five out of five. Uh transform. Uh, where do we send centers? There we go. Okay, okay. So we're gonna pull out, and I'm gonna take a look at the leaderboard. I don't know how long it's gonna take to. I don't know how long it's gonna take to update. Like two people, you like it because two people are winners. Yeah, like that uh, earlier where that Spencer guy was being like super. was being super super aggro like uh like we're on the same side bro i want you to i want you to win i don't want to come first okay i'm trying to find the tournament again all right here we go so here's here's the i'm 13th now i think it hasn't quite it hasn't counted my uh my latest game it hasn't updated in an hour um, but yeah, so this one's going to get replaced by, well, wh what will be really interesting is whether the damage done is really high because I, I blew up a couple cars. I don't know if vehicle damage is what counts, but if so, like going back to the, um, the other resurgence tournament, like shooting, shooting enemy players might not be the way to do it. Um, it, to rack up damage. Maybe I just need to blow up every vehicle in the game, in the match, and I can just get, I can just get loads of vehicle damage. Even though it won't count it in game, the the leaderboard will count the damage. Could be self-inflicted gas damage. Hmm. It could. It could be. You're right. It could be. It, even through the gas mask, even though I had a gas, or even well, maybe maybe when a gas mask broke, mm, might be the gas damage. You're right. That's that's a bit awkward. Then if it's a pa it's a pacifist, it's a it's a pacifist tournament, which punish you, which punishes you for getting first place, and maybe punishes you for going in the gas. That would. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's very backwards. Um, okay, uh, I'm going to call it there. Chat, thank you for tuning in. Um, this will update. When this updates, I'll be watching it. I will go down and I'll pin a comment under the stream VOD. And I'll just, I'll say what the final scores for these five games are. Um, and, uh, what, and, what, and, specific, and especially what the damage is looking like. Um, uh, thank you for tuning in, guys. Uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.